Yo guys, what's going on? Let's press some A buttons tonight. Uh, we got a Sidua here, 1320 soft resets, got a sixth phase at 1314 for a gold bat. And that one, like I said, they just, uh, you never know when you're gonna have a long hunt. You never know when it's just gonna just, just ruin your day, <laughs> or ruin your week. You never know. We got Carson there as well. Good to see a Carson. We also got Chrissy, I see Chrissy. We got Bye Love here. Yeah, spawns as soon as Brandon's stream starts. Pro pretty much, yeah, pretty much. It's pretty much ASAP. So if you want you want one of the goals, you gotta be faster than a millisecond, I think. <laughs> um, <clears throat> not a cheerful mood. Yeah, I saw the stuff. I saw the stuff in the uh, in the Discord. That's that's difficult. But luckily, nothing uh, nothing's wrong. It just sucks that it was seven hundred dollars. When they told us nothing wrong was wrong with Tango, they charged us two hundred dollars, which I was still mad about. But seven hundred, ouch! That's a lot. That's a lot. Yeah, Ultra Moon, Ultra Soon. That's oh, wow. What, what am I talking about? Ultra Moon, Ultra Sun. Yes, make Hermit. Pretty much just Ultra Moon at the moment. But yeah, yeah, dude, doing a doing a little something different. I've been wanting to do this hunt for so long, and I just never have gotten around to it. So here I be. Here I be. Um, well, I hope you're doing doing good there, McKermit. Let me double check. Okay, close. All right. All right. Let's make sure we got some stuff figured out there. Hello, Sax. Sorry about earlier. We we were out and about, and I hadn't checked anything. <laughs> hey, Austin. What's up, Austin? Yeah, U M U U M U U M U. Uh, your, eye, your eyes aren't deceiving you, says Carson. Exactly. Not deceiving you. We actually are playing this game. What's going on, Drew? What's going on? Shiny Man says, I've had my Switch since Sunday. You're getting the fan replaced. Oh, how long is that going to take? How long does that take? Twisted J. Hey, Twisted J. Hello, hello. Hopefully, you can join the Poible Club. Hopefully. Hopefully, man. I'm looking forward to that happening. I'm looking forward to it, but we got to get it to go. <laughs> we got to get it to make it, make it happen. We got to get it. So fingers crossed, fingers crossed that it happens soon. But I'm, I'm willing to put in the time to get it. If it's gonna take a while, I'm willing to put in the time. I think uh, I've been blocked from Amber Dorian stream, Chrissy? Oh, I've, uh, I don't know anything about that. But um, if that's the case, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, hopefully, uh, hopefully, um, you know, you know, they probably had their reasons, but you know, don't get down on it. Uh, Brandon has legit Poiple Hunt. What do you mean by quote unquote legit? <laughs> Is it not legit with the uh, capture card? You collect five more eggs and heads up uh, for my shower. I'll be back. All right, sounds good, bye, love. Yeah, do what you gotta do. Do what you gotta do. I understand. Get pizza for dinner. Nice. We almost had pizza for dinner, but then we ended up going to Taco Bell. Late, too, because we got a workout in. It's all about balance. We got a workout in, then we went to Taco Bell because that's how you do it in life. <laughs> but yeah, Shiny Man, I saw your, I saw your, your torkel. I saw that. Congratulations, dude. Congratulations. You're playing the saxophone and you likely blew it so hard it broke. We gotta clarify, you know. Yeah, I would raise my 3DS up and show you guys, but I'm afraid to pull the cord out. <laughs> I don't want to f up my settings. I don't want to screw them up, so. I'm not gonna lift my 3DS up. Maybe I'll show you guys when I switch over to the Sword and Shield or whatever, uh, or whatever we end up doing. Scarlet and Violet. I guess. Yo, Brainchild with the two month flex. <laughs> uh, good luck. I got mine from. Oh, my internet's dying. Oh gosh, my internet's dying already. What is happening? All right, we had some lag. Had some lag. Thank you so much, Brainchild. Uh, Mr. Gift, but I know it's a lot of talking. Anyways, drop in to say hi. See you. All right, Brainchild. Take care. See you later. Take care. Thank you for the two month flex, Brainchild. Appreciate you. But uh, take care and have a good one. Lemon, Mudkip. Hey, Mudkip. Straight Froze, not legit. Yeah, of course. Of course. Uh, me and my internet issues, man. Me and my internet issues. Story of my life. Yesterday went great, though. No, There's no lag at all yesterday. It was great. Then tonight, we make up for it immediately. But thanks for the member hype there to Sidui and Austin. Appreciate you guys. Tom's here. Hey, Tom. What up, Tom? Man, today was uh, Gluteus Maximus Day, and uh, like a kickboxing day. And dude, my my, I, I'm sore. <laughs> Not even gonna lie, right now, I'm, I'm my I'm I'm a little sore today. 
<laughs> that workout whipped me. I was not ready. I was not ready for that at all. My, my legs are kind of jello-y, not gonna lie. Hype from Shiny Man. Hype! Hype, bitty, hype, bitty, hype. Hopefully I can bring some, uh, some shiny hype today for the chat be pretty cool I'm, I'm like really looking forward to this hunt i don't know what about it I, I i've been excited about it um pretty much like the past two days i even thought about today i was like i can't wait to shiny hunt i can't wait to shiny hunt poi pull tonight <laughs> like i'm so excited i don't know why i'm so excited about it it's so weird um let's see what does love mean no it's like love it's like a it's like a cutesier way of saying love <laughs> like oh i love you you know it's just a, it's just a cuter way, you know. A lot of people were saying it at one time, and we just made it a command. It was just easier. It was just, it was just easier. <laughs> so it still lingers. It's still around. Ooh. Oh. Also. Also, my new card came in. The card I wanted. It came in. You can see the shiny lit, and it's hard to tell, but it's like that right there. You can see it. That's all it is. The only reason I got it is because there's one shiny lit on there. <laughs> I had to get it. Come on. Come in. Focus. All right, we're back in focus. We're back in focus. Nothing, but I got two full odd shinies in the span of five minutes. Nice, and Scarlet and Violet? I'm assuming, Tom. I'm assuming, unless, you know, unless you're playing something else. I guess Arceus can be kind of quick. Pokemon Bank shutting down this will be one of the rarest shinies. Until they, you know, until we get another way to shiny hunt it, whether it be Pokemon Go in the future, or if they finally include it in a game that we can shiny hunt it in. But yeah, right now, right now we are I'm trying to get this. I'm trying to get this. I'm, there's a part of me that wants to go get um, Ultra Sun. I want, I'm going to go maybe this weekend and go to the mall and just see how much they're charging for it. Because sometimes they have deals on on their games. I know they had a bunch of copies. Granted, it doesn't have a box, but um, I can maybe find an out of box copy. Pretty cheap. I don't. Need, I don't even a box. Oh, just ask a modder to transfer it. Not even an issue now. All right. All right. Love is love, says Jaunty. What's up, Jaunty? Love is love. Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. A no more. Deerling and Shrudel. Hey, two of the two of the ones that are kind of hard to see, Tom. Good eyes. Because I think with Deerling, only it's like flower changes. And uh, Shrudel, it's, it's, it's kind of a mini change. I think it's eyes change, but it's such a small Pokemon. So congrats on that. That's awesome. Back to you there, Decidueye. Back to you. Um, to make sure I'm not missing anything. I might have missed something. I hope I didn't. But it looks like I'm caught up. Looks like I'm caught up. I also thought about it, you know, like how the vertical streams, well, the pro, the profile style streams are kind of on the rage. I thought about it. I was like, this is the kind of hunt that I could probably pull it off. But I, I still, I still can't like get hyped about it. I don't know why. I thought about it today and I was like, man. <laughs> What'd you have for dinner, Sax? We had Taco Bell. <laughs> it changed so many times too. We were like, well, we have something in the fridge. And then it went to, um, well, we got to work out. So let's, let's work out. And then Allison's like, let's, we can make pizza. We have pizza supplies. And then we were like dying on the floor. Like, and we realized it was getting late. It was like 7.30 and I was like, like and Allison mentioned something about Taco Bell. So I was like, Let's just, you, you want to go to Taco Bell and like get it fresh, like get it at the place. So we went there. Oh, and I, I looked, they don't have pink lemonade anymore, Sax. It's like something else. I was, I looked, I actually looked today. Um, I didn't see any like pink lemonade. It was like a weird new thing. It was like strawberry something. I don't know. It was really weird. I don't know if that was it or not. I was afraid to get it. Hey, what's going on, cat? To pop a cat. <laughs> I like it. What's up, cat? Making some loaded burritos, nice. It made sense. It's like Taco Tuesday, burritos, tacos. Sounds good. Garrett, hey Garrett, how are you, Garrett? Uh, I got them while walking to evolve Palmo. Oh yeah, that part. Did you get it evolved? I know. I went to the desert to evolve that. I like walked around really slowly. Like it's a little more wide there. <laughs> and then only Pokemon trying to hit me. No freaking way. Yeah, I don't know what was going on. Or if they changed, they might have changed the name of it. I don't know. It was really weird. But I looked since I was in there. I was like, I'll, I'm going to check this out. I remembered. <laughs> I remembered this time. I'm trying to unwind. Sorry if I'm not super alert. To people, That's all good, John. You take your time. Take your time. Feel free to chill. You know, you got to do you. Gotta do you you got to do you. That's, that's important. 
Uh, vibin. Oh, cat, just vibin. Heck yeah. I'm vibin too. Only shiny hunting, but still vibing, you know? Just having a good time. But I'm glad you're here. Hopefully, the vibing is good. Hopefully, it's good vibes. McPokeberry Pie. Hello, McPokeberry. How are you tonight or today? <laughs> I just, I look out, I see my out my window and it's dark and I just immediately say, immediately say night. It's just my brain goes there. Uh, Tom says, yes, awesome. Uh, how goes the hunt for Poipol? Oh, it's going. The only thing about this hunt is like you can't phase. So it's like you gotta get the Poipol or not. <laughs> but no, I, I really like, I was, I've been really looking forward to this hunt. I've been uh, thinking about this hunt for a while. I don't know why I didn't start it in the past, but I think it was because so many games were coming out and then I forgot last year. So I'm going to get this. We're going to make it happen. Uh, I was doing a bit of shiny hunting in Dynamax Adventures earlier. Nice. How did that go? What were you, uh, were you, were you on one target cat or did you, were you just trying different ones? Yeah. Strawberry. Oh, strawberry isn't the same. Yeah. I, I was looking at it and I was like, what? I was like, it doesn't say pink lemonade or pink. So I was like, did they change the name? I, I mean, I should, I should have took a picture of it so I could send it to you and be like, is this it? It's, oh, it's night there for you. Okay. I, I'm, I always feel bad because sometimes I'd be like, yeah, good evening to you. And they're like, uh, I just woke up. <laughs> it's morning time. I'm getting ready for work. Porygon's in the DLC. Yeah, it is. It's in the cold areas. Oh, Suicune. Nice. I got to get Suicune too. I'm kind of tired of doing it. <laughs> We got it tired of doing it, but I need to finish that hunt, Suicune. Figured since I've started it in DAs, I should finish it in DAs. I'm in like the 70 count zone for it. I feel like uh, I'm a Marvel Fave 6. Like, what does that mean? Like, you're buff? <laughs> you're buff now? 400 checks. Austin with the lurks. Thank you, Austin. Your arm is sore tonight. Chrissy, what'd you do? Did you lift one weight? Did you just do one arm tonight? <laughs> My, uh... My shoulders, my buns, and my legs are sore right now. <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can stand up the whole stream, but I'm, I'm worried I might not be able to. My legs are super jello-y. Um, let's see. I've been reading a textbook for hours, and if I do anything else school-related, I'll punch a hole in the wall. Well, take a break, take a break. I've always said that, that's my biggest problem with school. I had such a good time in school. But the thing I didn't like the most is that you do work all day and then you have homework at night. And like, I just wanted to go like hang out with my friends. Like I've already done school work all day. <laughs> I've done my part. I've done my knowledge part. I just want to, you know, unwind. Nope. Gotta do homework. <laughs> a six shiny. Oh, six shiny phases. Oh, okay. <laughs> that went over my head. I thought maybe you were like training or something. I'm on the, I'm on this phase. Look at my guns. Oh you, fin oh, you finished the chapter. Okay, good. Well, yeah, definitely unwind. Close that book and throw it in your book bag. Don't throw it away. I almost said throw it away, but yeah, teachers aren't too fond of, of that. Or if you're in college, you pay for your own books. At least I did, and that was a lot of money, so I wouldn't throw away my books. And you had to buy it new, because if you didn't buy it new, you didn't get the disc that you needed that I never ended up using. I don't know. Some of you guys from, that have been to college might know that. They were like, you have to get the new one for the so you can have the book, and I mean for the, have the CD that you can plug into your computer. Never once did I use those included CDs ever, but you had to have the new one. You couldn't get the used. Don't work out. Well, you lost all that weight there for a little bit. Was that all just eating good? No, nope, no lifting weights. I had dance practice for most famous players and wing Oh, okay, that can make you. That can make you sore. Okay, gotcha, Chrissy. Hopefully that was a good time, even though you're sore. Hopefully you had a good time with it, though. Um, uh, Drew, you're going to go see what Carlos Beans is doing. All right, sounds good, Drew. Go have fun. Have fun, dude. Thanks for stopping by here. Appreciate it, but take care. See y'all. That and walking around, that's true. Yeah, walking walking still exercise. Just because you're like not moving weight doesn't mean that that is an exercise. So, hey, heck yeah. Heck yeah. Do what, We'll do whatever, you know? Whatever works. Now that it's warming up, I need to get back on my... My walking game, even if it's just a little bit, I get out and do a walk every night. <clears throat> Two thousand, twenty, like Two thousand dollars for books, get forty-five dollars in school credit at the bookstore. Yep, <laughs> I remember returning them at the end of the year, and it's like, oh, we can give you twenty bucks. Like, what? <laughs> I spent so much money on these. Shut the front door. <laughs> that was not good. That was not good times. 
I did not like college. It was not my thing. Some people flourish in it, and that's awesome. Um, but I, I did not. I struggled. Hallie has spoke my mind to my sister, and she blocked mom. And honestly, I feel like the force of nature wanted me to speak my mind. Uh-oh. Family drama. Family drama. That sucks. Family drama blows. Exercising on and off for a 13-year-old like me. Yeah, you know, you're, you're young. <laughs> Be careful of exposing your, your age on the internet. Don't want any, like, people being weird, you know? <laughs> we got Allison here, though, with the like. Thank you, A. Appreciate you. You can always count on that like. You can always count on that one. And a couple of you guys. Some of you guys are always on it. Uh, I'm in college and I had to buy a textbook. All the quiz answers for my humanities quizzes are on my own. Oh, your teacher's lazy AF. Oh, boy. <laughs> Well, try your best, even though they're lazy, try your best to get that knowledge. I'm a, I'm a big believer in, in like learning. Ed, the education system's a little interesting, um, but I am a high, I, I believe highly in like learning and having knowledge, especially in a world where there's a bunch of misinformation. Our show starts April 30th, May 2nd, May 5th. Oh, so you're gonna be in front of people? Or are you gonna be in front of a crowd? Like, ooh, whoa, whoa, yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, ah. Kind of like that. You'll be fine. All right. Uh, I gave my brother a pep talk and told him, thank you for being you and realizing the important and sacrifice mom has done for this family. Well, that's good. That's good. I'm sure he's happy to hear hear that. <clears throat> you are? Heck yeah. All right. All right. Do you, Chrissy, are you a stage fright person? Are you? Can you handle it well? I didn't think I'd have stage fright. And then one time I got up on stage with my, my band at the time. And I realized like, holy crap, like this isn't what I expected. My, my brain like shut off. It was like, this is scary. And it wasn't even like a big crowd. It was probably like 70 or so people. My brain like scrambled. <laughs> I read the textbook sometimes and I'll read it more. All right. Yeah. Just get the knowledge you need. You know, you don't have to be a scholar. But you know, just, just, you know, have some smarts. Don't have stage fright? Awesome. That's good. That's a good skill. Uh, some people, some people's biggest fear in life isn't like even dying. It's public speaking. <laughs> some people, like a, a lot of people, like some people would rather die than speak on stage, which is crazy. Like I get stage fright too, but if I had the choice between the two, I'd be like, all right, I guess I'll, I'll try to get up here and say something. <laughs> Uh, not looking very sparkly there. The big brother power. I will rise my brother, rise my brother up and lift him to greatness. That's good. That's good. Ooh, ooh. The inside of my thighs are burning. This is why with the sigh, sigh. Four hundred fifteen checks. I wonder if I, I always wonder if I'm like higher up on the checks than than this. I feel like I missed a couple checks yesterday. Yo, K Chan, I don't get stage fright by punching, oh, picturing Brandon shirtless. Oh, okay. And whatever helps, whatever helps, man. You know, I, I'm I'm here to help. I guess in your in your in your in visionary mind, I'm here to help in that way. <laughs> Austin finding some candy. I, need to, I keep forgetting to change that to rare candy. Find a piece of rare candy. We gotta get more Pokemon themed things on here. Just took a hot shower, feeling refreshed. Shower! <clears throat> Nuts. Looking different there. You know what, you're one of the good Pokemon YouTubers because unlike most streamers, pay attention to what people, uh, what people say. I think it's because, you know, my chat doesn't move that fast. The, the, the more subscribers somebody has, well, not all the time, I take that back. Well, the more popular someone is, it's, I get it. It's harder to read the chat. But, you know, we're, it, it moves it moves at a moderate speed here. Sometimes it's really fast. <laughs> I try to keep up, but phew, sometimes it's tough. Every once in a while, we have those nights where it's like, oh my God, I can't keep up. Sit you with the side eye, side eye. Really sore arm. 
because you're building muscle from all those all those movements. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, I got to visit some streamers that are bigger, like you know, like HDV and stuff like that. And I'm like, dude, how in the heck? <laughs> how do you read those chats? And he doesn't read everything, but still, uh, I think he does a pretty good job for the amount of you know text that comes through there. Do 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 do. You received a poiple. This crowbat hunt is taxing. Yeah, it happens, man. Trust me, I was there with the uh, the Ursa ring. The Ursa ring was good times. Granted, like it was different in the sense I got two checks at once, but still, it took longer than I wanted it to. <laughs> Definitely took longer. I get it. So it's those long hunts. Hoping this isn't one of them. Well, I just realized we didn't get the the shiny on 420, which you know that's sadness. That's sadness. Yo, Meta here with the hello, Mr. Poiple. I know, right? Does Poiple have a gender, or is it just Poiple? <laughs> I never really have looked into that. Not that it really matters. I could care less, but I'm sitting here thinking about it now, like. You don't chat much anyway with the streamers with more than 100,000 subscribers. You don't chat at all. You know, that's fair. That's fair, Raven. I appreciate you popping in, though, and every once in a while. It's always nice to see see names in the chat. I know I, I couldn't believe it. I, there was a, another day, um, uh, it, was, it was a couple months ago, uh, someone was like, I've been lurking for months, but I finally decided to say hi. I was like, wow. I didn't know people did that. Honestly, I don't know why people think I'm stupid. You're not stupid. Um, hardware or emulator? Hardware. Uh, I got a 3DS with a capture card. Um, so it's about as legit as you can do it, I guess. Poi pull is a yes. <laughs> it's a yes. Hey, Scrobo. What's up, Scrobo? Scrobo, did you see uh, the the uh, Winnie the Pooh Blood and Honey 2 has 100% on Rotten Tomatoes? I don't know if it has it now, but... Um, I thought that was interesting. Amazing background. Hey, thank you. I, I'm surprised. I, I threw this together so quickly because um, I was in a rush at work. And I was like, I just need something for the stream tonight, yesterday. And I, I kind of threw it together real quick. And like, you know, after I put it, set it up, I was like, I really like the way this turned out. <laughs> for a rush job. Because I was like, you know, like, I, I mean, you've been in this spot probably meta where you're like, What? background should I make like what what do I do <laughs> what where am I gonna go with this vision next is 666 yeah I guess I gotta wait for that one <laughs> how much did uh, did that have to pay to get people to yeah I know right so I wonder how many how, how many how much money they paid <laughs> I know it's funny seeing the look on their faces when I stick up for myself I'm just here listening with shiny hunting Garrett what are you uh, what are you shiny hunting right now Garrett uh, at least they got some redemption. Yeah, didn't the other one have like a thirty percent or something? The other on that, yeah. I uh, me too. I'm, I I do a lot of you know I do a lot of editing at work uh, for my main job, and so I don't put in a ton of effort for my stuff because I'm usually burned out. But I'm like, I was like, I gotta make something. I can't just use my old layout. I didn't I didn't like my old layout, so I was like, well, we'll come up with something quick. <laughs> you hate Matang? Why? Because you can't catch it. I know it has a terrible catch rate. I think I've lurked for the first few months. I still lurk in a few streams while I cho do chores or cook. Now I get you. I, the streams I'm in, I'll go on streams during the day, um, and I and I mostly lurk. I'll, I'll try to chat a little bit, but with with work and stuff, I kind of like having a stream in the background. But yeah, most of the time I'm working, and so I support my pals and and, and all that good stuff and the in the watch hours category. <laughs> Vibing to this music. Yeah, I turned it up a little bit. I listened to the stream yesterday because I made a new new TikTok today and I noticed the volume was pretty low on the music, so I cranked it up a little bit. Oh, a 3%. It's even worse. <laughs> I need to watch it. I mean, me and Cam were talking about it and I was like, I was like, yeah, the only reason I didn't watch it is because you said it sucked. And he was like, you should still watch it. <laughs> I uh, started reading again, so I have stream in my ears while I read. Okay. 
See, everybody's different. Like me, if I was reading, I don't think I could watch a stream. Like my brain would fo get hyper focused on one or the other. But with work, I can, you know, kind of focus on both. Nice, Tom. Congratulations. Yeah, it's a hard catch. It's a hard catch. You just gotta keep trying. I'm a gentle giant, but if you push me to my ginormous limits, I will strike. Gotta, you know, gotta rage. Wah! Got, gotta rage. Almost choked. Almost choked on my own saliva like a, like a, like a dweeb. <laughs> and that's not looking shiny. I can't wait to like transfer this up to, to a like sword and shield, I guess, to make it my buddy. Cause I don't, it's, it's not in Scarlet and Violet, is it? I don't think it's in the game, but if it is, I could put it in that game too. Watch the caps. Yeah, be careful on that. It just like influences everybody for some reason. <laughs> shiny hunting Noibat and Halucha. Ooh, good luck, Garrett. I, especially Halucha. Halucha is such a good shiny. Noibat is too. I like that green, greenish, whatever color, but mm, freaking Halucha. And Halucha is a great Pokemon in general. I like having it on my team. Don't think so. I, I don't recall seeing it on the list, but you know, people people have weird things. They showed flexed on me when I would have like the camp or whatever <laughs> in the game. So I thought maybe if anything, we'll we'll throw it out in uh, in Sword and Shield uh, to get it get a view of it in HD <laughs> current level graphic HD, I guess. Pulled out my level 100 Skeleters and used a Safari Ball, which catches lower level Pokemon. Okay, all right. Safari Ball. I want the Safari Ball to like return in a larger way. Or like have a Safari Zone again. I kind of like those those little things. I was I like that feature. Uh, I've been reading Wilbur Smith as he was one of my favorite authors. Finished Courtney's Warriors Day. Started reading Tiger's Prey. Sounds. Oh, both titles sound intense. They sound intense. I wonder if Allison knows that stuff. I'm not a huge reader myself, but um, Allison's a big reader. She got her Kindle, rocks the Kindle, and gets real books too. She like really likes them. It's kind of like the way I am with music. I'll like if I really like an album, I'll go buy it. Um, if not, I'll stream it. <laughs> it's kind of like the same equivalent in a way. Yeah, like in Diamond. Yeah, I kind of, I, I wouldn't mind for them to bring like a Safari area. I know it's called Safari Zone, but it'd be kind of cool just to have an area like that in every game. Like a whole separate area. Like, you know, it could just be this wide open, wide open field or something. I think that'd be kind of neato. Now check those out. Mel Metal. Mel Metal. I have shiny Melton in Pokemon Go. That I still wait. I think I actually brought it over to Sword and Shield. I need to look that up. I feel like I did. Could be wrong. But it sounds familiar. Yo, Mr. Wolf is here. What's going on, Mr. Wolf? What's going on? Oh, unfortunately, he passed away in 2019. Oh, it sucks. The good thing, you know, like it's never good to lose like somebody like that, but. The good thing is, like, at least they left uh, some works that we can always, you know, cherish. Um, that's kind of the way I am with, with music. At least there's still, like, still, like, stuff. Oh, yeah, Metagross. Metagross. Billy, knock, knock. Who's there? Who's there? I'm scared. <laughs> What's going on, Billy? Yo, your gifted membership died. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, they only last 30 days, I think. But, hey, at least you don't get, you don't get charged. I'm so glad that it doesn't like start reoccurring on somebody's account. <laughs> that would be crappy. But yeah, you know, you never know when another one might come your way. Hello, Brooke. What's up, Brooke? I uh, hope it doesn't hurt tomorrow. Just stretch it, Chrissy. But it might hurt tomorrow. I know that I work out the second day, like the day after the, the next day, like it, like it hurts. Like, you know, it's weird. You, you who? Very serious he did when uh was the Egyptian one. <laughs> Egyptian one. Um uh, everybody saying hi to each other. Okay, I'm making sure I'm not missing anything. <laughs> I don't want to miss anything, so I'm just watching everybody say hi. Love being here, says Tom. I like it too. I like it too. I like this spot. This is my spot, I like it. <laughs> it's a good spot. I enjoy the spot. 
that is not not shiny. We just keep not shinying. We'll get there one day. We'll get there one day. I'm making knockoff California burritos, basically. What what constitutes a California burrito? What makes a burrito California? It's cool to talk to people while shiny hunting. No, I agree. I agree. Before I was streaming, I I, I would lurk in streams. I would chat sometimes. Uh, get involved with communities and just just hang out. Uh, I got, just got out of a hot bath. I feel bled. Yeah, I saw your message there, Brooke. I'm sorry that you're having a not a good time. I, I think it might be just extreme allergies. I know when I get it really bad, I, I just lose all all motivation, all alert <laughs> alertness. Ugh, it's not fun. Not fun. But hopefully it goes away soon, Brooke. Hang in there. I know how you feel. I get the, I get it too. Oh, we had to use chicken sacks. Hey, nothing wrong with that. I love me some good chicken. Love me some chicken. Been dreaming recently while I sleep. I think we always dream. If you remember those dreams, it's, you know, off and on. But I think they did research that typically we always, we always dream. Hello to you too. Hey, <laughs> I didn't want to like ruin it. I didn't want to, so I just went with it. Had to have a good punchline, yeah. Never came up with a good punchline to that. It still works, it still works. Beautifully done, really, beautifully done. Let me hear uh, with this community as well. Well, thank you, Chrissy. Appreciate you guys, you know, sticking around, hanging out. Means, like, I always, I say it a lot, I'm a broken record, uh, but I appreciate it, guys. Y'all are cool. Y'all are cool to hang out with. Lurkatito from Decidueye. Uh, typically the steak fries and all the fixings like guacamole and such. I don't know guacamole, so not for me. Do it on the side, you know, just in case your girl wants it. <laughs> does she does she like guacamole sacks? Uh, manage to clean up while the, uh, uh, all while the, the daytime cold medicine is working. Hey, you gotta take those opportunities. You got that pep in your step when you're not feeling well. You gotta do what you can. Like. Ch -ch -ch -ch. Uh, I did not remember I dreamt I was vacationing on tropical island and went for a canoe activity. That's fun That's a fun dream. At least uh, you didn't have like a dream that you won a gazillion dollars or something and you wake up And it's like oh man, I should have known that was a dream <laughs> Tagged his name so I can borrow from the library. Oh nice Allison knows what's up Taking Raven's word for it like I said, Allison's a bookworm, so she'll take book recommendations. Got all the laundry done? Nice. That's just like, you know, that just means more relaxation time. You're not th you're not thinking about it tonight when you're laying in bed. Bye, love, all clean. Nice. Nice. Clean is the good way to go. <laughs> it's, not, it's nice to be clean. Eat or eat or. Like squeaky clean. Let me know if you enjoy it. Like, Allison blows my mind. She'll, like, start a book, and then, like, the next day, I mean, it's like a 300, 400-page book, and she's like, I'm done. I'm like, what? <laughs> yeah, I put another three-hour shift today. Oh, short-staffed. Oh. Uh, uh, luckily, it's only three hours, so, you know, it doesn't get, like, old and redundant, but, you know, you gotta take some time for yourself, too, Billy. You gotta take some time to, to get your own relaxation. Don't wanna bear, don't wanna wear yourself out. <clears throat> always the scary part it's burnout but I'm grateful at my job every six weeks the seventh week we get off because we work at such a fast pace like my business partner was noticing that everybody was just so fatigued you know people started you know sleeping in over sleeping so he was like all right every six weeks everybody gets a break um, just to kind of shut down their brains for a little bit grateful for that I used to read a book a day growing up. Yeah, see, like I said, I'm not a huge reader, so like that style like blows my mind because I'm like I look at a book and I'm like that would take me a month, <laughs> but like some of you guys just go through it, boom, like like supercomputers. How does your brain work while you sleep? Does your conscious mind shut down and your subconscious uh, mind come out, and that's why we dream? There's, I've never looked into it, Chrissy, but I'm sure if you do some research on it, you'll probably find an answer. Um, you're probably onto something there. This does sound kind of right. Um, yo, Andreas, what's going on, dude? How are you? How are you? How are you? It's only three hours, more money in my pocket. Yeah, that's, that's the only way I look at it is like, it is only three hours and it is money. So, 
Like, you know, it's not like you're pulling like a 10 hour or eight hour, whatever. Three is doable. And it can, those, depending on, you know, what you do, it's, you can go by pretty quick. Um, yeah, your brain's always active. That's why, you know, have you ever went to bed before and you fall asleep really fast, but you jolt up, you feel like you're falling. It's like, but you've only been asleep for a couple, like a couple seconds or a couple minutes. Like you legit, your brain is always active. So if you fall asleep really fast, your brain sends signals like, yo, is, is my human body dying? <laughs> Let me check real quick. And that's why you jolt up. You're like, whoa. Cause you know, your brain's testing to make sure you're alive. <laughs> so those days you're really tired and you jolt up next time. Remember that that's why just a, uh, just a survival instinct. You let the pups out to potty before I lay in bed. Yeah, it's a good idea. Don't want them holding their little bladders all night. Can't have that. Chilling. Those are Zygarde DAs. Oh, so someone else got it. Do you do you have one? I feel like we talked about this before. Do you have one already? I think you do, don't you? Hate that feeling. I do too. Like it happens on like whenever I travel. Like whenever I travel a lot, it somehow travel exhausts me. And so I'll, like it happens pretty frequently. I'm like the first night I'm on in a new place um, after I've traveled all day for work. Like I'll have those jolt moments. I think it also doesn't help them in an unfamiliar place. It's kind of annoying. You get that feeling sometimes. Yeah, I think we've all experienced it. The jump scare, <laughs> the jump scare effect. Um, I already have two shiny side guards. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, I remember us having like a conversation about that. That's awesome. That's awesome. You're already, you already did your, your prep stream. <laughs> your prep for uh, Legend ZA. You can bring it over. You got two amazing paths, like right now, or for those two you got. You hate that feeling, Sidua. It, it's not good. It's not good. It is not very cash money. Because then you can't fall asleep for a little bit because your heart's pounding. You're like, oh my gosh. But, you know, I appreciate my noggin for, you know, double checking to make sure I was alive. <laughs> Better than being dead, you know. Be wondering how people, uh, Pokemon XY are prepped for ZA, not even the same model. You know, I honestly, I think, you know, it's just for, it's just clicks. I think that's, you just put it in the title. I, I, I think that's the strategy for it, I think. I like to laugh at it though. I get why people do it, but it's nice to joke at a little bit. <laughs> Same BDSP was prepped for PLA. <laughs> Theoretically, you know, I've, I've seen a couple streamers do it right. They're like, shiny hunting in Pokemon ZA discussion stream, you know, like chit chat. Like that makes sense to me. That makes sense, but I get it. It's, I think it's just all for clicks. Gotta get people their mouth watering. They see that new logo. Click. Yeah, I get you, Brandon. Represent, Chrissy. Represent. Oh, yeah, the path's right now. Sorry, I missed that message, Andreas. My bad. <laughs> I just saw that. Whenever I like, whenever I get a chance, I like skim up through the chat to make sure I didn't miss anything, and I did. 1360 self resets. Ah! Streaming GTA 5, GTA 6 prep stream. <laughs> you could. You theoretically could. Why not? <laughs> Yo, what's going on there, Jason? Quaxley Doc. Hickory Dickory Doc. The duck went to the clock. Yeah, no problem, Christy. No problem. Yeah, you didn't know you can grind Dino Ore and Dynamax. Uh, but yeah, oh, didn't know you could gri grind Dino Ore in the normal Max Dens? Really? I was going to say, I, I know, like, I would just, like, if I found a God Path, I'd hope I'd get the Shiny. And then, you know, once I got the Shiny, I would do some just random DAs to build up. Just in case another God Path happened on my next hunt. I hate when I dream I'm still, oh God, I'm still working. Uh, and wake up exhausted because of my mind of worked all night, dude. When I worked retail, Mr. Wolf, that happened to me. I would have dreams about being at work and like my alarm would go off and I'd be like, no way, no way. <laughs> that is one of the worst things. 
How's the better beedrill hunt going? It's going, you know, I I, I really like this. I, I've been wanting to do this hunt. It's not like exciting by any means, but I've been wanting to do this hunt so bad that like my excitement overweighs the, the patience I need to have. Yo, Tyler, what's up, Tyler? How's it going, man? Any any luck on the DAs? I know that uh, I saw a lot of people picking bad, bad paths. <laughs> uh, and that's one of the big reasons DAs would grate on my nerves. You'd be like, go left, and everybody would go right. Like, <laughs> like, bruh. Bruh. Uh, Mr. Wolf stressed out. I guess that's what it is. But yeah, I used to have work retail dreams. Um, and have to go to work. Like, once I woke up, I had to go to work. Like, ooh, gross. What a terrible dream. <laughs> Am I going on a hiatus? Oh, DA's, DA's great. You need to, if you're gonna do DA's, I know you wanna do the, the Dialga, but maybe, maybe do an easy one. <laughs> do an easy one you don't have. Just so, you know, you know, you get to rely, rely on the recent DA hype, and at the same time, you get a little break. Am um, I getting good sleep lately? Oh, that's awesome, Andreas. That's awesome. Hopefully it keeps going, man. Hopefully you don't have any bad nights. That's always nice, especially when you have a streak of it. Be lurking on my TV, Christian. All right, sounds good. On, oh, yeah, on your TV. I get you. I get you. Well, thanks for the lurks, man. I, I really do appreciate it. For those of y'all lurking, if there's any lurkers, thank you. You guys are cool. Got Palky and only two. Man, I, I have yet... I mean, I guess I, I can't say much. I got Rayquaza. Uh, and six Dynamax Adventures. But all the other ones I think have been a little long. I think one of the Tapus was 20, upper 20s. But after that, it was like 70s or up. Dialga was 17. That's not too bad. 17 is not too, too mind numbing. Accidentally updated my Switch. That means my homebrew currently doesn't work. So no more Shiny Ripe. Oh no, really? You accidentally updated it? Ah. Shoot, dude. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I guess you know, like I, I'm, a, I'm, I'm guilty of the A spam when I like start when I'm like when I have a controller in my hand. I will be spamming the A button a lot. I would probably totally do the same thing. Uh, Garrett's just chilling. Bugs have to sleep. Oh wait, what? Why is Cricketot a, a daytime only? <laughs> Bugs have to sleep. Raven with a good comeback. Thank you for replying to that. That was a good that was a good response, Raven. Reshram and two check, that's awesome. I think that was a 70-ish one for me. Oh no, that was the one that I went I went a hundred checks without a phase. At least a hundred. I think it was like a hundred and something for Reshram. Finally got that finally got that blinked out Reshram. 81 for Ho-Oh. Man, the highest. Some people just, you know, some people just got it. Some people got that good RNG. Oof, yeah, foof for the the update, the switch update. Yeah, it's all good. 18.0.0 is the update. You gotta wait for atmosphere. Oh, to have a new version. Man, well, hopefully it's soon. Hopefully they don't get shut down by Nintendo or whatever they have to do. <laughs> hopefully nothing comes that way. Nintendo been kind of on a rampage lately. It seems like I don't know why. All of a sudden, it's like, yeah, so we, this has been around for years, but we're just going to start messing with stuff. Gotta slow down the A spam, right? Right. I, I need to have that drilled into my head quite a bit. Hatching Skrelp. If no shiny, then I'll do Ice Q. Ooh, I love Ice Q. I actually like non shiny Ice Q more than it's shiny, more than the, uh, the shiny. I like the, the black and blue version. Um, let's see. Hey, E, what's going on, E? Good to see you over here. Good to see ya. I almost missed you saying hi to me in Tyler's stream earlier. I was out with the dog, and I luckily scrolled up, and I was like, oh my gosh, because I saw your, like, you know how, like, on a short stream, like, the chats start fading out, and I just saw the slight at my name, and I was like, oh, I almost missed E. Yeah, I gotta go sleep. Have a great stream, Brandon, and chat. Hey, Andreas, thanks for stopping in. Appreciate you stopping in. Good luck on those, uh... Well, you already got the shiny. Well, have fun hosting <laughs> the Zygarde raids, dude. But thanks for popping in, man. See ya. Second fastest 58 checks for Kyurem. Dang. I'll probably do a... <laughs> it's all good, Andres. I, you know, people misspell my name all the time. It's all good. I know what you guys mean. I always joke. It's like Arceus, Arceus. 
I know what you guys are talking about. <laughs> but yeah, I, I, you know, if I, I, I need to do Suicune at some point. I just don't know when I'm gonna do it. Like when I think about Dynamax Adventures, I it like just just makes me go. Mm. <laughs> Arcus, yeah, that too, Arcus. Anyone here do some BP grinding? Everybody wants to jump in by Love's lobby and do some BP grinding. Let, let each other know. Y'all are playing some games and you know you want some some points. Uh, JJ, so I have 24 hours next week, and my boss said he'll do his best to work within the allotted allowance of 1,072. I'm allowed to take uh, take a month on my disability income. Okay. I guess they gotta do what they gotta do, right? They gotta do what they gotta do. Get my bike finished back in for a second. Oh, what? Uh oh. Oh god. One of my, my, my one of my coworkers like lost control of his motorcycle. He's tuning it up tonight and it almost ran straight into his car. <laughs> Yikes. I thought I said it hit his car. I was like, that's not gonna be a cheap fix. He's got a Tessie. I know how expensive those are fit to fix. Um doing some gaming at the moment. Nice E. What what uh what game are you playing? Or is it a secret? If it's a secret, that's okay too. Illusion! What's going on, Illusion? How are you? How are you? Shiny Stunky for Tom. That's a stinky, stinky shiny, but a shiny nonetheless. Congratulations there, Tom. Is that a new one for you? Or is that a dupe? Oh, it's a racing game? Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Like, like a, like a sort of real sim or more arcade? I've always been more of an arcade racing person. <laughs> I've always kind of sort of wanted to get like a sim racing, like get eye racing, get like a full on like racing set up. But first of all, it's really expensive. And two, I probably would get my butt kicked and lose interest in it. And I would waste a bunch of money that I don't have. But it'd be really cool. So I just stick with Mario Kart. Because, <laughs> you know, I, I'm, I'm, always, I'm always cool with some Mario Kart. Yeah, no dupes so far. That's good. That's good. Heck yeah. Oh, you don't know how to explain. It's all good, E. No worries. No worries. All good. Don't stress. <laughs> I'm always a little inquisitive, you know. I like to make conversation, but if you can't explain it, that's okay. We ain't gonna judge you. Do not worry. Vibe in my brain's a bit fried after working on a quick project. Ooh. Yeah, take a break, man. Take a break, break kick back. And, uh, yeah, hopefully, uh... Hopefully, um, you get some time to just relax and decompress their illusion. Uh, they told me they want to take care of our number one with his new overlords. Ooh, fun. <laughs> overlords. Uh, I'm getting to that age where, like, I one day I could have a manager that's younger than me. And while that's okay, it, like, messes with my brain. One of my superiors... I was like super young when I worked retail. Like they were just a little older than me. I was like, we could be like full on like friends and hanging out. <laughs> uh, they have a long weekend coming up. I do not. I do not, Tyler. I have Saturday and Sunday off. Allison gets Friday off, but she she gets a lot of Fridays off. And if she works on Fridays, it's usually till two. So she's she's she gets an, a long weekend. I do not. What about you, Tyler? What about you, man? Starting a new hunt for a Coco. Ooh, you're gonna be doing some Masuda method, Bryce. Some ma -ma -ma Masuda. Oh, instead of cars, it's dragons. Okay, all right. <laughs> hey, racing game's a racing game. Eggs. Eggs. I accidentally went back 20 minutes as I joined. What were we talking about? Death. I don't know. Oh, probably because like I was talking about like that feeling when you jolt up, like you've only been asleep a couple seconds or a couple minutes, you jolt up out of your sleep in a panic. It's just your brain is checking to see if you're alive. <laughs> Cause your brain uh, takes long, like some kind of, sometimes can take longer to fall asleep than your body. And yeah, I think that's what we were talking about. Let me some Mario Kart, also have Disney Speedstorm. Oh yeah, I remember that. I saw you in Kemp's uh, 24 hour, Chrissy. I, I was racing against you. I saw you on my screen a couple times. 
<laughs> I think you blasted me one time with a with a red shell. Pretty sure. Unless, you know, you were just in the right spot. Because I remember getting flipped and I saw you go, meow. <laughs> yeah, do enjoy the Fridays off. Yeah, Allison gets it good sometimes. Stress, stressful job for her, but she gets some good, good, good days off. Only Friday off, but those are half days anyways. Wish it was Monday. Yeah, I would enjoy a Monday off more, honestly. Fridays kind of already feel like, especially if you have a half day. Fridays already kind of feel like a little weekend eve. It's like a pregame kind of at work. <laughs> Everybody's kind of like already thinking about the weekend. But um, yeah, I'd rather have a Monday off. It was a good, uh, it was a good, uh, I finally sat down and found, a, and found a MIDI on my laptop you were putting off. Wait, like music wise? A music wise illusion? Yeah, red shell and green shell. Yeah, you can dodge a green shell. I guess, I mean, if you have an item, you can block a red shell. You can block that as well. Blast you with a shell too. I had a feeling, I had a feeling. No, no, nothing personal. <laughs> That's the way Mario Kart is. I, the, um, I, the first race I jumped in, I won. And I held, I have a bad habit of doing this because I get so competitive. I was leading and I held my breath until the <laughs> till the end. And Allison was like, wow, you're breathing really heavy. And I was like, yeah, because I held my breath for that whole last lap. <laughs> did we hit the light? Did we hit the light goal? Hey, we did. Let's go. Taco Tuesday light goal. Let's go. Let's go. Throw a blue shell and I'm going to use my boom box. <laughs> Alkesh, with all the ways bringing that shiny luck. Thank you, Alkesh. Thank you, dude. Appreciate you. Yeah, you can block the blue shells too. That's right. Yeah, Illusion. Do you make music? Do you make music? Is that your is that your thing? Is that your project? Cat. Hello, cats. Hello, cats. That's not shiny. We're getting close to 500. Numbers are racking up. The numbers keep racking up. I have to get up tomorrow and go to the doctor for an appointment at tomorrow at 11.30. Ugh, yeah, I don't like the doctor either. I don't like the doctor either, I feel you. Oh, hey, disclaimer on what I'm about to say. Uh-oh, Prost, what's that? A lot of events this week. My niece's birthday, Jess's mom's birthday, and then we're having Easter dinner with uh, my parents on Saturday, then with Jess's parents on Sunday. <laughs> Dang! So you guys, you guys have definitely have the the busy the busy weekend coming up. You should name yourself Busy Tyler Cross. You can block can you block two blue shells if they are within quick vicinity of each other? But no. <laughs> so my friend got uh, name banned on Super Animal Royal, like that weird derpy animal fighting game. How do you get name banned? Uh, the whole approaching Cynthia thing is short yet really intense and I decided to finally try it. Wait, what does that mean? Approaching Cynthia. What do you, what do you do in that? His name was hilarious. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. You remix Pokemon themes. Heck yeah. Nice. How long have you, been, how long have you been making music? I love getting satisfying scores and races. I mean, um, you know, especially if you like beat like a beat, like a time or something. I remember I used to do the, do the time trials like crazy in Mario Kart DS. Mario Kart DS was my jam. I played like like crazy until I got tired. Like in Mario Kart DS, you had to master snaking, and like eventually I got tired of doing that. Like I, got, I was like I was so over it. But there for a little bit, I was all about some time trials and online battles. Um. username was wow I don't even know if I want to read that out loud that sounds like like genocide or something <laughs> is there like a bunch of white animals in that game or something <laughs> trying to figure out why you would do that me and my brother would always play Mario Kart DS Mario Kart DS was so good like I, I actually like Mario Kart 8 Deluxe the best Mario Kart Double Dash is my second but Mario Kart DS is my third but I probably spent more time with DS than I did any Mario Kart game. He says, yes. I uh, can see why I got name banned. Yeah, I can I can see that. I can see that. It's like at racing games, I can never get first place. I used to get first place, but not anymore. 
it it gets tougher. Um, you know, every once in a while you'll probably be playing some people that are really good. And also like when it comes to Mario Kart, like you can be really good at Mario Kart. I consider myself pretty good at Mario Kart, but it's up to chance too. You never know when you're going to get nuked by a blue shell. And once you get by a blue shell and you get back to third, you start getting hit by red shells. Like, you know, it's just, um, it's just wild. It, it definitely keeps you in check. Uh, definitely not good at racing games. SNES Mario Kart was the best. I played that one a little, but I also had the one for Game Boy Advance. Game Boy Advance was cool. Picked up remixing some years ago after having FL Studio for a few years. I figured out how the MIDI files work. Nice. Okay, cool. Ooh. I've always been fascinated by music, but I could never get myself to sit down and learn it, you know? Always had ideas, but then I would jump in a band with some friends. <laughs> But then everybody went to school and that kind of ended. But it was good times. Good times. Um, oh yeah, Thomas' Double Dash. Double Dash was awesome. I thought it was kind of cool that um, two player could be implemented like one of the people could be uh, you know just chucking items while somebody drove I thought that was really fun uh, and ironically enough a lot of the players he's killing were uh, had white names it was like Mr. Beast James Carlson Jason yeah still though ooh, that's a little extreme <laughs> that's a little extreme of a name <laughs> I know it seems kind of innocent, but I don't know. <laughs> I get it. Uh, did you win in Mario Kart and Chris's 24 hours? Yes, I won two times. Wait, three times. I won three times, Chrissy. I won three times. My friend screenshot it. Uh, Megatron. Hey, Megatron. What's going on, dude? What's going on? Dark humor. <laughs> You received Poipole. Are you colorful? Oh, we're at 500 checks. We're just plowing right along. Well, 501 now. Uh, I remember once in my primary school, my principal took a GameCube to school and played Double Dash. Really, a principal? Oh my gosh. I remember the uh, the GameCube. I always thought it was so cool. Like my, my friend, one of my friends was the first one to got, get it, my next door neighbor. And he brought it over. He was carrying it like a suitcase, and I was like, that's fascinating. <laughs> it had like a handle on the back. And yeah, I, I didn't get mine until Christmas, but mine was the platinum edition, the silver, it was like the silver chrome one. It was sick. Well, it was more silver flake. It wasn't chrome, but it's still awesome. Currently, I changed the rainbows and unicorns, and you can't change it? That one's better. <laughs> that one's better. You're doing good at Megatron? Heck yeah, dude. Glad you're good. Glad you're good. That's what I'm talking about. Mine takes a lot of patience and ignoring your laptop being really unhappy with the process. Yeah, I mean, music. Music, um, you know, it takes a pretty long time to, you know, find that thing. Because you can typically come up with a melody, like, okay, that's the structure of the song. And then building it is where it gets really crazy. It's like, oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Zelda was so good on GameCube. What, Wind Waker? Dude, I want them to put Wind Waker on the Switch or whatever the next console is. Because I thought it was cool to play it on the Wii U, but I can't play it on my Switch. What the heck? <laughs> Pretty sure I'm driven on that bridge. Really, Tyler? Dude, that was scary as heck. I, I mentioned it on, uh, you know, I, I, I said it on Twitter. I was like, that's one of my worst nightmares. Like, I, I whenever I'm over any kind of bridge, I see that. Like, I, I think about that. Like, and so seeing it happen, my stomach dropped. I was like, like my heart sank into my stomach. I was like, oh my God. <laughs> Uh, hey, Clocky. Thanks for the lurks, dude. Thanks for the lurks, man. Hope you're doing well. I get, uh, get Friday off, and I'm planning on uh, working on my Jeep restoration, putting seats and putting bed liner and the sound deadening in. Hey, cool, dude. So yeah, I'm guessing you just have like a Jeep carcass you're rebuilding. <laughs> doing some rebuilds. That's not shiny. Um, let's see. I'm going to go to bed in about 25 minutes, Brandon. I have to get up early again tomorrow. 
I have building bridges again tomorrow morning. Well, that's good. I get it. I get it. Like, you, you gotta get your rest, Chrissy. That's totally, totally understandable. Totally understandable. Um, let's see. You saw the AccuWeather. What? The bridge? Yeah, the, bri the bridge situation was bonkers. I, I didn't. I, I just saw the video, and I was like, holy crap. I hope nobody is on there. But apparently the cargo ship radioed in was like yo mayday mayday like we keep like we're losing power uh, we might hit this bridge and luckily police got there and stopped people um it could have been much worse so much worse that bridge could have been full of people uh, especially early in the morning uh driving over that bridge since so she was freaking out safe to say i drove all, all oh yeah on the way back it's like a it's like a mile long like I don't know what the plan was there, but like, you know, now that it's fallen, I guess, you know, you don't expect that to happen, but now that it's fallen, it's like screwed up a lot of stuff. Like, like that's nuts. Your cat was on there. Wait, what? Your cat was on what? The game? I got it running, but the window was stuck down for years. So the seats and carpet trash. So I got a new carpet. Oh, okay, nice. All right. Do a little, do a little restoration on that hopefully since you seems like you had some progress already done uh saw that on the news it was scary yeah that was crazy crazy that like it's it's a freaking mile long and it just fell oh your cat was on the bridge cat was on the bridge sheesh <clears throat> But yeah, that was, that was intense. Definitely uh, didn't add to my bridge paranoia at all. <laughs> Got it running by yourself. Hey, that that's impressive. You know, that's impressive. As somebody that has no rebuilding skills, <laughs> that's that's impressive. Question for the chat: Ryu or Ken? I like Ryu in the in the group styles of Beyond. <laughs> Good rap group. Uh, that tracks me screwed for oh for a long time, dude. Long time. <laughs> like, like it's gonna be like that. It's a mile long. I can't imagine they can just like build it in a couple, you know, a couple months. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a massive project. Like it's like freaky, freaky. No mechanic, but I can pull apart and replace it. There you go. <laughs> there you go. It's a bridge inspector at NYC. I saw a video like of a guy like I guess his daughter was in an accident and the guardrail went through her car and somehow missed her and she got a couple cuts and scrapes and it, her, her car flipped upside down but she lived and I, I was reading the comments and apparently like guardrails are very like they're not put together well at all like there's a guy on TikTok that goes and like shows will go up to a guardrail and show how it's not installed right and he'll fix it like that's crazy man like i never think about that stuff i'm like man so if i hit a guardrail there's a chance that they didn't build it right and it's not gonna work properly yikes i guess i won't be headed down that way anytime soon it's about an hour really you're that close Jeez, i know i know it's still an hour away but that's like it's still kind of like pretty impactful for you since you've driven across it it's Ryu. Yeah, I just say Ryu because the rapper I, I listen to is named Ryu. But it's spelled R-Y-U. <laughs> so I just say it like that. I'm used to hearing it like that. Ryu, attack beer, machine shop. Fort Minor. For the, the Street Fighter characters, uh, Allie? Oh, Allison. You're talking Allison. <laughs> I was in there like, hold on. Who? I thought there was a character named Allie because I was about to say, yo. And Allison in that game got lost. <laughs> I did too. I did too. Honestly, I used to work for the largest bridge fabricator on the West Coast. It'll take at least a year. Yeah, I can't imagine it's gonna be, you know, because they get first of all they got clean it all up, and apparently there's a uh, you know there's missing people, so I think that's the top of the priority is they gotta find the missing people if possible. Um, yeah. Oh yeah, calls you Allie. Yeah, I was I was I was lost for a sec. <laughs> I was lost. Uh, I mean, there's a clan, a Mortal Kombat called the uh, Shri Ryu that is actually spelled that. Oh, Ryu. Ryu. 
Hey, Hassan. I'm good, man. I'm good. How are you? How are you doing, dude? Uh, pronounced. Pronounced. I had a feeling that's what you meant. I had a feeling. I got a feeling. That's how you say eat that word. All right. This is it. Never mind. I lied. Erase that from your memories. Erase it. Tomorrow you'll hit 3K on the Reggie Drago. Oh, that's not fun. Getting still under, I guess, still under odds. It just doesn't. It just doesn't sound fun. How old was that bridge? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. It's just a massive cargo sh ship. Hit it full speed, basically. Did you hear the NFL adopted the XFL kickoff? Really? What's the XFL kickoff? I, I wa I've watched it before, but I don't remember that. I don't remember that. Oh, built in 1977, so it's not that old. Is that a wild crocodile? <laughs> oh, a wild. I thought you'd be like a like you know like a wild, <laughs> wily coyote kind of thing. Oh, na, 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 na. This may still have the design then, then save time. Still have the docs, still have the documents and whatnot. It's just, it, it's just, I don't know. Like at first, I was like, "Oh, that's scary, that sucks." But then, like, I found out how big that bridge was, and that made my brain just go. The whole thing fell, <laughs> and they gotta rebuild it. It, and also, I saw a video of, and so it said, like, what is wrong with people? But people were like, police were stopping cars from going over that bridge this morning, and people were going around them, like, like oh, you can't hold me up. I was like, what are you gonna do? There's no bridge. <laughs> like, I, I think people are broken. I think humans in general are broken. <laughs> like, where are you gonna go? Like, you're gonna have to turn back around. The police were legit stopping you for a reason. The people were like, no, I'm going to keep going. Like, what are you going to do? Try to ramp over a mile long bridge? My daughter was freaking about driving over bridges now. Really? I, was, I mean, I've been saying it like, it's not like a, an irrational, like it's not like a crazy fear of mine, but you know, it's always in the back of my head when I'm over, over like a street bridge or something. Sitting there like this better not collapse while I'm on it. I mean, it's in the most respectable constructive way, but you unironically might be the worst pronounced guesser I've ever met. I've ever met. Oh, I've, I've, I've embraced it. I've embraced it for sure. <laughs> I just own it, man. I just don't even say it, think twice. I just, I just own it. The only time I apologize if it's somebody, uh, you know, who's like, you know, new and they like their names a certain way. I uh, just came in to say hi and leave a like. I'm going to uh, uh, going to bed clinicals today. Oh, cl clinicals killed me. Hope you get the shine. Hey, thank you, Crows. Get yourself some rest. Sounds like it's well-deserved. Sounds like it's well-deserved, but take care there, uh, Crows, and have a good sleep. But take care. Some humans do evolved. A little bit, yeah, a little bit. Um, Let's see. <laughs> it's hilarious. It's 1977, around the same time the World Trade Center was built? I honestly don't know. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Light goal 65. Oh, did we hit the light goal? Let's go. Let's go. Thanks, guys. Appreciate you all. I don't know if we'll get to 65, but, you know, we'll reach for the stars. $600 million? Is, I feel like it's going to be, it's going to be more expensive than that, right? $600 million? I feel like that's, you know, that's a lot of money. That would legit be like the most insane amount of money I've ever seen in my life, but I feel like it's probably going to cost more than that. This burrito's hitting, says Zax. Hey, I'm glad the, uh, I'm glad the hard work paid off, man. Crow's name sounds like mine. Pros. Well, hold on. Crow strikes. <laughs> the, the, the bay. Oh yeah, the Bay Bridge collapse. It is one of those things. It's possible. There's a bridge in Cincinnati that I cross over, and I honestly will get the the, the heebie-jeebies <laughs> going over that bridge because it's like to me that's long. I'm like well, what? Especially if traffic backs up on it. Um, yeah, that's what they're saying. Okay, just on estimate. Okay, six hundred million seems cheaper than I thought. I uh, hope for the Drago to shine before 3k. I feel like Hefty endured enough torture for everyone hunting it. Yeah, for sure. 
everyone endured it enough, but you know, every once in a while, some of us outliers get these long hunts. Tommy saw a video of it. Yeah, it's pretty wild, pretty gnarly. Pretty gnarly. Um, uh, have you seen this man, Bryce? The the, the Foy Coco? <laughs> You're the one looking for it. <laughs> have you seen that man? Have you seen it? Did you video the new kickoff? The benefit is that we'll get more returns this year, so it kicks through the end zone. Good. I hate that strategy. Like I want to see, I want to see those big runs. <laughs> like I, I I love I love a big like. When they break free, they find that they find the right spot. Oh, it's so dope. <laughs> Heck yeah, alright. I like hearing that. I like hearing that. No, Bryce, oh you have it. Well darn it. Darn it. Spiders give you the heebie jeebies? I don't mind spiders too much. The bigger they are, uh, the more I am affected, yes. But you know. Love spiders as pros. Yeah, spiders don't bother me too much unless they get bigger and bigger or like if I see a tarantula, I know that I, I just I, I don't I don't want it on me. <laughs> if it's just you know minding its own business, walking by, cool. Like look at you, dude, strike your stuff. But I don't want it on me. <laughs> going for uh, going for Clefairy and let's go Pikachu. It's taking forever. Ooh, just like are you waiting for it, Megatron? Just waiting for it to to pop up. As far as I'm okay with, as long as I can see it, right? Like, I don't want to, like, wake up with one just, like, on my face or something. Like, but I can deal with a spider. Typically, I'll, if I see one in my house, I'll catch it and release it outside. Like, go go out there. <laughs> I, you can go do your thing out there. Not getting on their bad side, though. The bigger the, uh, the, bigger, the more so love them, believe it or not. Seeing a spider as big as your head on YouTube. Yeah, those, uh, what are those? Oh man, I forgot what they are. Like they're like garden spiders. They're like massive, like huge. Um, there's like a famous photo with one with a bird wrapped up or whatever around it. Yeah, if your spiders chill with me, I'm chill with it. Yeah, most of them are there just to you know eat bugs. They just live their lives. They just happen to wander into your nooks and crannies sometimes. Houses has no things on spiders. Um, I messed that up. That sentence, just substitute the word so for I. Um, so I'm not getting on their bad side though. No, I don't I don't think anybody wants to get bit by anything. Even small spiders can be scary too. Yeah, I guess so. You know those like little small jumpy ones? <laughs> like they're not scary, but they're startling when they bounce up. Love snakes and everything. Snakes! I'm not really scared of snakes, but I don't, I really don't want one of those on me. Um, I remember I was on a, in Arizona and like everything in the desert can try to kill you, I guess. And there was a, there was a snake just slithering along the path. We were walking, we walked at like four in the morning before it got hot and we were on the trail and I got behind, I got way behind. Luckily I had one path all the way through. I was by myself and I was walking and there was just a snake on the path, like a big snake. It was pretty big. And I just watched it cross the path in front of me. I was like, all right, go about your day. Black Widow and Brown Recluse. Yeah, those are, those are not good. If you, um, you know, Brown Recluse aren't big. That's true. No snakes either. Don't mind snakes. There was, that blew my mind. I, I, I've seen a snake. I've seen a couple snakes while I've like mowed. But um, there was a, it was like in the fall last year, I was in the backyard with Tango and Tango like ran after something. And I was like, what, what was he, what, what, like, why is he freaking out? He was like twitching and all that stuff. And I ran over and there was a snake slithering down the side of our house. It was pretty big. I'm pretty sure it was like a rat snake or something, but it was big. And Tango of course was like, I need it. <laughs> I was like, Tango, get away from it. I don't want you to get nipped or something. But uh, that's probably the biggest snake I've seen that was around my house recently. But it went underneath my deck, and I don't know where it went after that. Yeah, but they are deadly. I remember one time I lifted up uh, like a drainage thing, like you know, like off the side of your house. It's like the concrete thing underneath it. Well, I guess that can be plastic too. But I lifted it up at my house, and there was a black widow underneath it, and it was right by my hand. That was close. Cats eating popcorn, yum. 
I love me some popcorn. Save some for the rest of us. Festivus for the rest of us. Centipedes and other small creatures that I hate. Did you know those little, those, those million leg thingies that you find in your bathtub or sink or whatever? I found out just today, those things are super beneficial for your house. They'll eat cockroaches, if you have cockroaches. Like they eat all these like terrible bugs. <laughs> Like they're actually not that, granted, you know, it doesn't look very sanitary if you have them just chilling in your house, but apparently they're not the worst thing you can have in your house. This is GY with the popcorn. I just started yard work this week, mowed the yard. We're in the process of uh, working a flower bed. Nice, Allison wants to do the flower bed thing. Um, and I haven't mowed yet. I've been putting it off, but there's a lot of spots in my yard that are getting pretty tall. So I guess I probably need to knock them out. There's a six to seven foot black snake in our basement. And everyone treated me like a superhero for picking it up and taking it outside. I remember one time, I mean, that's crazy. I remember one time I was mowing and I almost mowed over this little guy. I, uh, I saw him like peek out and he was like this long and like the, it, I, it was like almost like the size of like a big worm, but it was a snake. It was so cute. It was like adorable. <laughs> I'd never seen a snake that small before. <laughs> it's so cute. Never run into a black widow spider, it'll poison you. Yeah, I prefer not to get bit by one of those. Uh, this might be gross for people. I watched two snakes eat each other whole in a live. That's, uh, that's an interesting snack to choose. One time I was with my dad helping him outside in the yard work and we cut a root, which was oh, which hit a snake and cut it in half. Oh, poor snake. <laughs> Leaving that thing alone, says Brosk. House and Pete's, yeah, as long as I don't see them, I'm Gucci. Yeah, they're just really, like, we had one for the first time in a while in our house just the other day i like opened the shower curtain i was about to take a shower and it fell and i was like whoa like, you know you don't expect it it just falls like, it starts freaking out and i was like oh my gosh jump scare those gross me out they have actually come at me those I hate those billion leg things yeah they typically almost look like a blur across the ground because i got so many legs and those makes me question that I have something in my eye Doggos are all situated, and you're back, Brooke. Welcome back. Glad you got those doggos taken care of. Now, hopefully, you can lay down for the rest of the night. I was young when you saw that. I found it strange there's a difference between poison and venom. There is. There is. I used to catch uh, black widows and pull their legs off <laughs> before you found out how venomous they were. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's different how we treat things before we find out they're deadly. That's funny. So I always wonder like how, how humans have survived this long. How do we make it here? We've done, humans do a lot of silly, dumb things. <laughs> you see that video of the hiker in the rainforest? I feel like there's a bazillion of those videos, Tyler. What's, what happens? I was running in the field with my dad and there was a cool baby snake in, in, slither in front of us. It was cool, yeah. Typically, if you see wildlife, just leave it alone. It typically won't bother you. Now, if it does, you might have to throw some hands, but typically, like snakes, spiders, whatever, you can just go on right by. I once accidentally hit a li hit uh, hit a little snake with the weed eater, just barely, so I caught him and cleaned the cleaned it up and kept an eye on him and then released it. Well, that's nice of you, Brooke. That's nice of you to not immediately be like, "Ew, die," you know. Girl one, why do we live longer than guys? Girl two, I don't know. Boy one, hold that trash lid like a shield and we'll see if he'll protect you against this bullet. <laughs> I mean, when I was younger, we used to imitate the good old Jack A show. <laughs> um, we did a lot of stupid stuff. I survived though, I survived. Poison, you eat it, yeah. Venomous, it eats you. You get, you get the bite. You get a leech under his eyelid, ooh. I used to think of when Steve-O did that in the, speaking of which, in the Jack A movie where he got his uh, leech on his, on his eyeball. Ugh, yikes. Yeah, if it'll, it might, yeah, it might attack cat. It might. The upper lid, couldn't get it out. Oh, dude, I'd be, I would be freaking out. <laughs> I would be losing my mind, dude. I would be so stressed. I mean, just get this thing out and I would never go hiking ever again. No, thank you, says Allison. <laughs> I'm not much of a camp kind of person anyway. I'll stick to the city. I might. I mean, I like going out in, in nature, but, you know, just I'm not going to. I don't think I'm going to do anything over, you know, over crazy. 
Uh, if you see a moose run away, leave it alone or you will be at heaven's gate. A moose. Moose are big. I know that because of the guy that's right after you in chat, Kem. He's told a story about meese. Meeses. Mooses. Sending that video. Hey, Kem. By the way, hello, hello, hello. I was, I was like, this morning, I was like, oh, I guess it's time for the Cam Nation show. And then you weren't live. And I was like, oh, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> you might need a break. Start hiking in some of the goggles, right? I don't even like the ocean anymore. Like, you know, I, I like the ocean, but I don't like the idea of the ocean that much anymore. Just like, what's in it? Hear all these stories. Nevin, hello, Nevin. What's going on? How are you? Pretty much know about all the breeds of snakes around here, so I know what, uh, when one is venomous or not. I probably should get more in tune with that myself, Brooke. Cute thing that happened today, cat. What's that? What happened? When I used to go to camp, there were, we were walking on a trail, and this dude in front flipped over a board, which had a pretty decent sized snake underneath it. You know, it's you know that snake probably freaked him out, but that snake, you know, was just chilling. That snake probably was like, "What the heck, dude? My house." Mega famous YouTuber. That's right, Chem Nation, the mega famous. Mega famous Nevin says doing good. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Glad you're doing good, Nevin. Hummingbird came next to me and I was next to the bird feeder and I went and I heard its wings humming and chirping. Dude, uh, Allison's mom has uh, a hummingbird feeder. Those things are crazy. It's pretty crazy. They just like, you know, you can barely see their wings. You see their body. It looks like their body's like floating around. <laughs> it's pretty wild. I left a batting glove outside and I lost it for a while. Found it, put immediately put, oh, a nest of earwigs. I made their home in the fingertips. Yikes. That's really freaky, Megatron. <laughs> that's kind of gross. <laughs> oh, that's nasty. Knowledge is power. That's right. Knowledge is power. I was thankful we didn't step on the board, right? And like I said, like, you know, nature was there first before we came and invaded, I guess. So, you know. Game Boy, send me that video, says Kev. <laughs> what are earwigs? Look it up. They're like little bugs. They're like buggies. Found it and sent it. There you go. Signed, sealed, delivered. I'm yours. Oh, that was terrible. I don't. I don't got pitch tonight. I don't ever have pitch, but that was it, that was explicitly terrible. Don't get an earwig in your ear. Is this hunt still legit? Yeah, too legit to quit, Sax. Too legit to quit. I live in Jumanji. The ocean is the least of my problems. Make Pokeberry Pie out there with a machete walking through the forest. Come at me, fools! Pincher bugs. Pincher bugs. Uh, hatched a female shiny. F oh, hatched a, you hatched a shiny female ice cube, but it's pink. <laughs> I feel like that one gets a pass since it's pink. It's better pitches a baseball game. Oh, it can happen. It can happen. I'm not an expert singer. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta warm up even to be on somewhat of a pitch. Don't talk about earwigs. No, no, no. We don't talk about earwigs. Would you take the pole? Would you like to take the poipol? Uh, yeah, I love the poipol, especially if it's a different color than what I've been seeing. That's even better. I mean, look at those blue eyes it has. Look at that sprite. It's got those those baby blue eyes. Uh, it was under his eyelid. Yeah, that's what that's what uh, Tyler was saying. Ugh, yuck. How far is this hunt into the game? It's near the end, I guess. I think I'm close to the end. For those of you that have played all the way through, because um, I've never played this game uh, all the way through, how, how close am I to like the end end? Am I pretty close? Orlando, hey Orlando. Yeah, that's the worst part about food sacks is when it's over. And you look at the, you look at the stuff you've cooked and you're like, like the Will Smith, like at the end, just like, Looking around the room. Sounds like there's a backstory for that request. Yeah, it does. It does kind of sound that way, doesn't it, Megatron? Getting there. Would you ever have bought your channel for growth? No, I would not. I would not. I would try things, you know, try things, but no, not not bought. 
Finding some good deals. Gonna find a good deal. Come on. But no, no, none of that. None of that. <laughs> I, I've, I've no, I know accounts that have gotten banned because of that reason. I know a guy who knows a guy that knows a guy that has a nose. No, because if you buy if you buy followers, eventually there's going to be you know if it all works out, eventually those accounts will probably get erased at some point. I don't I don't want to do that. The guy has a girl, by the way, a little girl, girl, <laughs> the nose of burrito, <laughs> the nose of burrito. I just know all the... Re I, I, I've said this story before. The main reason I'm way against it is I had to deal with um, that consultant when I worked at the car dealership who would buy his stuff just to like flex on us and say he was good. But then I go to Social Blade and see his like random like 10,000 subscribers gain and it would just fall off and he would buy them again. <laughs> and But our, our uh, employers didn't see that. And I tried to try to get through their head they finally fired him though god that sucked i need to get going now like i said i have to get up early tomorrow morning good night everyone hey good night chrissy thanks for coming to hang out but yeah you you're busy you're busy it's totally fine go take go go get your sleep there chrissy and we'll catch you around see you later and then uh the noah guy who knows a guy reminded me of that movie know a guy that knows a guy that knows a guy that i might know I know it's another guy. Infiltrated the YouTube community. I feel like I'm I'm getting hints that it's something is going on. <laughs> so there's a troll on Twitch who is botting Pokemon Unite streamer. How, how does that happen? Is, is their team like really strong or something? Send a pick of the snake I found a while back. Snack picks. Let's go. Snack picks. There is to be news to you. Okay. Okay. Oh, you missed a message? Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What, what, what did I miss? What did I miss? Oh, backstory. I, I, I guess I, I guess I'm lost. Uh, are you go Oh, wait, I see Decidueyes. Are you going to do the clown ghost hunt in this game? Clown ghost hunt? The Blacephalon or whatever? Whatever that thing is? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. 1400 resets, soft resets. Ew. Ew. Gross. Ew. <laughs> but, you know, maybe. We'll see. We'll see how what we'll see what time allows, you know. We'll see how we how we go how things go here. I've just been so excited for this hunt. My main focus is getting this 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 little poiple guy. It's poiple. Like you go to their stream, bot follows and make their alerts go crazy, really. Man, that's a little like you know if you're like especially if you're like a kind of like a small streamer like say if you only have like you know a couple hundred subs or something and that happens that probably feels so good until you realize it's, it's like a bot <laughs> or you're getting botted. Can I get you like in trouble too? Right, you have one more egg, then you gotta collect more. Ice cubes a slow hatcher. Uh oh, is it? Just just uh put it under hotter incubator. Used to have a big pet snake. I, I sometimes I've been in public before at places and people have a snake with them, just like hanging out. I'm like, uh, I guess that's their pet. Big nope noodle. How wouldn't you know though? I don't I, I, like. I don't know honestly. <laughs> Except don't match the viewers and interactions. I don't know. I don't know how it'd work. I hope it just doesn't happen here. Because <laughs> I don't know what I would do. Get excited for a second, then be let down. I'm going to take a break from shiny hunting and watch the stream. All right, Garrett. No worries. Do what you want. Do what you want, but we're glad to have you here, Garrett. Glad to have you here. I'm going to go. Hope you get to the shiny, and I'll see you Thursday. All right, sounds good, Tom. appreciate you being here. Thanks for hanging out with us. Thanks for hanging out with us and all that good stuff. But have a good one, Tom, and we'll catch you. We'll catch you next time.
See ya. See ya, see ya, uh-oh. Is that, I think the message is refusing to show up, Megatron. I don't see it. All I see is that last message you sent. I think that's what's going on. <laughs> Got shiny Metadite on Violet Dash. Congratulations, Dash. Let's go. Congratulations. That's actually a really pretty nice shiny. Pretty nice shiny. Back to you there, uh, Chrissy. Back to you. Have a good night there, Chrissy. Have a good night. Your cousin breeds and sells snakes. Hey, more power to him. I saw a video one time. It kind of went viral, I think, a couple years ago or like whatever. But there's a guy that like, I guess they, they're working on an animal thing and there's snakes. And the snake like comes out right when he's trying to shut it and it almost bites him. And he's like, no. And he like chucks it back in there. <laughs> I was like, what? What a boss. <laughs> Maybe it didn't like the name. Yeah, you know how. I'm st I, like I said, I'm fully convinced, fully convinced that YouTube is using some like like lame AI to like do stuff like determine what's good and what's bad in, in chat oh there's the picture of the snake dang Brooke that's a big that's a I don't know if I saw that I probably would be backing off just in case but you said it's probably not poisonous right freeway Coco I'm in love with the Coco when we first saw Cell on Direct DBZ, what was your reaction? I thought it was dope because it was actually scary, like, you know, his first form. And I didn't have any spoilers when I watched the first time. Like, you know, the internet was still in its infancy. It was there, but I wasn't really thinking to look up um, things like that. And it was freaking awesome. Because <laughs> it was spooky with all, like, the sucked up bodies and stuff. You watched a movie. It was called... Parasites. Okay. <laughs> I guess I guess sometimes you just have to like make it work. I know I've heard of Parasite. I've never watched it. I never watched it, but I've heard of it. I want to know when Nintendo's going 4K, like when they're going 4K quality, like 4K is the best quality all the time. I know 8K is the best, but when they're gonna announce 4K quality. I would just be happy if the next Nintendo Switch console ran at like 1080p 60 frames per second. <laughs> Honestly, with how far behind Nintendo is usually, I'd be ecstatic. If we got modern frame rates, he's your favorite villain in DBZ. Yeah, he's pretty cool. He's got some good fig arts as well. The, the action figures I get, but they're expensive. They're expensive of him. I get the cheaper ones. <laughs> They're in 2019. Yeah, I remember. I remember it. I just never saw it. I heard good things about it though. There's so many movies that I just need to watch. I need to sit down and just roll through. <laughs> That's not it. Who another hit TikTok? Let's go. Well, by hit I mean it has two thousand five hundred views, but I'm feeling good about it, especially since I uploaded a couple hours ago. If you ever watch, you'll understand why the why the guy I know the wait, hold on. You understand why the Noah guy reminded me of it? Okay. Yeah, I do need to watch it. There's a lot of movies I need to watch. <laughs> I'm like there's always movies I'm like, oh I'm gonna see that, and then I just don't. I don't know why, but I just don't. I want the stinking bat to shine. I want this this stinking fairy fa robot fairy to shine. That's what it reminds me of. I don't know what Poipool exactly is, but it reminds me of like a like a robot fairy. I was gonna play Sun and Moon. Uh, me and my Mimo got me Pokemon Sun on a trip and went uh, went one time. And we got to play it for about a week until I couldn't get an DS. Oh really? So did your, did your DS break? That's terrible, Garrett. I also need to get a new theme from the background, dude. I, uh, you know, you can mod your Switch and get cool backgrounds. But dude, I cannot believe in the year of our Lord 2024, we don't have anything but black and white theme on the Nintendo Switch. Like, I, it's one of those things, like, they could have just put, like, you know, for Zelda, a green background with, like, the Triforce crest with the bird at the bottom. I don't know. <laughs> like, it, I don't know if it doesn't feel like it seemed like it would be that hard of a thing to do. 
but it, it's so wild so wild that they never did anything and they're at the point now where we're getting talking about a new console so i don't think we're ever gonna get themes on the nintendo switch it's wild to me wild okay you're back cookie were you here and in, in, in gone <laughs> well welcome back sorry that i didn't see you come in earlier odd odd i'm off to bed not to really sleep though okay all right bye love take care if you're heading out if you're heading out and shutting down the stream for the night take care have a great sleep and hopefully we'll catch you soon yeah the year I, megatron I always find the find that makes like when when you're like trying to drive home a point like when you say that it's so much more funny like <laughs> i don't know why like, I don't know, it just, it just adds to the emphasis. I, like, but in all, like, all jokes aside, I can't, I, it's kind of baffling to me that we have no other, like, they didn't even give us other colors. <laughs> like, like, they didn't give us, like, red, green, blue, yellow, pink. Like, are you kidding me? Black and white, that's what you get. Night or daytime theme. <laughs> Tom, you're back as well. Welcome back. Welcome back, guys. I just got here, I had to wake up myself from a nap. Okay, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, Cookie. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I always laugh at my brother in Christ. Yeah, my, my friend Kevin, he was here earlier, K-Chan. He always, he always sends my sister in Christ to me. He's like, my sister in Christ, we need to get together soon. <laughs> Try putting the game inverted colors and mess with your eyes. No, don't, my, my, my eyes are already messed up. I don't need them more messed up. I paid money to get them fixed. <laughs> don't need any more. Don't need any more eye problems. Sleep, Bryce. You going to sleep? You you sleeping like that Mimikyu? The Mimikyu looks so cozy. You got their nightcap on and everything. Oh no. Okay. All right. Just making sure. Just making sure. Also, guys, thank you for the 37 likes. Appreciate Chaz. And that's not shiny. That's not shiny. Chanting inverted colors is fun. I've seen people do it. I, I couldn't. I, like That would mess with my eyeballs. How was your dinner? It was Taco Bellerific, Cookie. How was your dinner? How was your dinner? Bryce says, I trade. I trade. It's the new trading from Apple. The whole cave is why is it ghost in inverted colors? Yikes. Yeah, that would that doesn't sound like a good time. Straight up not having a good time, dude. <laughs> that would be me in the cave. Oh, I got that cell theme song. Stick in my head. <clears throat> a jack-in-the-box day it wasn't too bad hey good i'm glad i'm glad that it wasn't too bad you know if you're gonna get fast food there's always that chance you might get some get some you know a, a bad batch a bad batch of food it happens you have any gen 5 games do i uh, <laughs> I'm trying to think if I do. Oh, black and white era. <laughs> I had to look that up because I'm stupid. Um, I don't. I don't anymore. I had black. I had black, but I don't know where it is. I never sold it. I never sold it. I don't know where it's at. Like it's somewhere. It exists in my realm. I just don't know where it's at. It might be in storage. But I'm not entirely sure. But I did have it. Who's your favorite DB character? Yours is Gohan. Mine too, Garrett. Mine too. I uh, I really like Future Gohan, but um, he he RIPs. But I really like Gohan. Yeah, I was I, I was stoked for superhero, and it didn't let me down. Been getting quesadilla uncut and wrapping it around a cheesy gordita crunch. Holy crap, Megatron! Nice, nice. That's pretty dope. <laughs> 
That's that's the Taco Bell secret menu right there. But it's not like console games we could change the theme as PlayStation. Like, come on, Nintendo, show your theme background. Please just do it for us. <laughs> the, the employees probably got good themes. Pokemon Goku Black. That's right. Took some nighttime cold medicine. Uh-oh, is that going to knock you out, Brooke? Knock you out. Ba -na 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 -na. Da -na 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 -na. You say, uh, knock me out. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully. Uh, man, black and white are, are mid. I have the better version known as Pokemon Silver. This joke actually aged horribly as Pokemon Silver actually exists. Uh, yeah, and the Gohan's new form is cool, but we only get to see it for about two minutes. But yeah, in the manga, you know, like, yeah, we get to see more of it though. So I'm excited about that. I'm excited. Whooper, yeah, you're earlier. Heck yeah. Good to see you there. Whooper, Whooper channel. Good to see you. Getting close to 1420. 1420, ladies and gentlemen. Please have a seat and get ready for the LOLZ. I was trying to combine white and black to make, oh, silver. As you can see, that did not work out. <laughs> Yeah, now we we do have we do have silver as Gen Two, Gen Two. That was uh my my the one I ended up getting because I loved Lugia. Lugia was my dude. Well, I still I still like Lugia. I still like Lugia a lot. Black and white. Yeah, yeah. You got a point. <laughs> Uh, Demon Demon, cut myself a shiny Verizian. Oh, and Sword and Shield, congratulations. Nice. I love that shiny, by the way. Heck yeah. Congratulations. Congratulations. Ah, uh, yes, Luigi. It's a Luigi. A Lugi. Lugi, Luigi. <laughs> Austin still sitting here with his, uh, his gold Ultra Ball. Let's go. Let's pretend it's an Ultra Ball. <laughs> A gold ultra ball with the sparkles. But yeah, you no problem there, Demon Demon. Congratulations. Congratulations on that. Let's go. I'm gonna have like a I do have like you can't really tell, maybe. There's like legit like a like a dent in my finger. You see that? <laughs> the circle where I've been pressing the A button? <laughs> I have an A button no, it, the, the the A doesn't have like a texture, but I have the button print on my on my on my finger oh, you're feeling better said Joy. good 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 glad you're feeling better you guys remember when Xeno erased multiple universes after being bored yeah <laughs> I'm not a big like being a fan of Dragon Ball is hard because I don't like the fact that everything's getting super overpowered like you know I, I, I was I, I don't know I, I, I struggle with it because you know I, I love the characters I'll always love it I always watch it but the only thing is with Dragon Ball the characters are just gonna get more and more powerful <laughs> Except the poor humans. Like, I still like Krillin and Yamcha and Tien. I think they're good characters. But everything kind of gets out of the realm. Out of their realm. Unless they sort of get some kind of Zenkai boost. Okay, I got threatened by a lion. Yeah, we just recently watched Dragon Ball all the way through. And man, so good. So good. Need more eggs. Time to collect more eggs. Um, let's see. Yeah, Wooper Channel doing good. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Young Trunks is the best. I like uh, Future Trunks when he first comes and just obliterates Frieza. Like, that was that was like a one of those defining moments when I was a kid. Because we just had watched Goku struggle for about a year. Like, you know, the way the episodes aired, it was about a full year of watching Goku fight Frieza. And then Trunks comes in and just whoops up on him in a couple seconds. And we were all just like, what? <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> I loved, I, I, I just recently got a Future Trunks figure. It's dope. <laughs> Super dope. Even though his, his sword doesn't like to connect and keeps falling out. Uh, Dragon Ball is way more popular than Naruto and One Piece. Yeah, it, it is. But at the same time, like those are both also very popular. 600 oh i didn't even realize we're at the 600s dang we're really we're really cranking through these encounters <laughs> I, uh, it's not a bad thing though that's not a bad thing yeah he pulls up the naruto signs and everything yeah <laughs> hey frieza it's like i'm telling you man it's iconic i remember it <laughs> 
Hands on my favorite, holding down in perfect cell is awesome. Yeah, that part was really cool. Like that was that was such a defining moment. I remember watching that for the first time and I was like, come on TN, you got this. Just, just blasting back level two cell. Like Piccolo, did you know Piccolo is Akira Toriyama's favorite character? Uh, I just started stressing because we just went through this. Ah, oh, man. What a time. Trunks with the gang signs. And, yeah, gang signs and massacres, Frieza. <laughs> I love how in Superhero they showed it basically in real time. <laughs> and, like, it's crazy how fast Trunks beats up Frieza. You know, they slow it down the anime to, you know, fill time. But Superhero, like, legit showed how fast it was. Like Trunks just like blasts him, Frieza jumps up, and then he's like, <laughs> it's over. <laughs> uh, furring the latest chapter. Wait, what, Whooper? Oh, why was he waving bye in the manga? Who? Who? Like Trunks? Yeah, Allison always jokes when I get something, she's like, hot Trunks. <laughs> they have like a figure of Trunks, like with his jacket pulled down. <laughs> Oh, Piccolo as homage. It's I think the last chapter of the manga that came out was done and written before Toriyama passed. I mean, I don't know, coincidence wise. I know the manga's on a break though. The Trunks and Goku fight. Goku uses his finger, that was epic. Yeah. That was still cool too. Like Goku had increased his strength a lot as well, that he can battle a sword with his finger. I like Goku, my favorite female character is Bulma, the OG girl we all know. Yeah. I like I like Dragon Ball Bulma. She's I feel like, you know, and it makes sense. Dragon Ball Z and stuff. She has to take kind of like a back seat. She's just like the human that helps out sometimes. But you know, she had a big role in Dragon Ball. <laughs> Your wife has a thing for Vegeta, really? <laughs> he's a bad boy. He's no, he's a bad man. He's a bad man. He's got that when he's got that pink shirt on. It's his bad man on the back. Hot topic, but Sonic. Wait, does Sonic beat Goku? I, 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 I don't want to offend anybody, but I think Goku beats Sonic. I have a roll of toilet paper by me. I'm all snotty. Hey, you know it's better than you know dripping all over the bed and stuff. In my opinion, trying not trying to start a war. You like Android 18? Woo! <laughs> Android 18. Krillin, Krillin got that. Dude, dude just went for it. Shout out to Krillin. He just went for it. Didn't hold back. Uh, it always cracks me up how hard Yamcha got traumatized by Bulma, and I assume you're aware of him very too. Yeah. Such a heavy sleeper. <laughs> I remember the I love the scene when he like he like tries to peek in the window to see where the Dragon Balls are, and it's just Bulma in the shower. <laughs> oh man, what a what a scene. There's, that's another thing. Dragon Ball. I don't think you can make Dragon Ball these days. It's very raunchy. Like it's a great. It's a great series, but it's pretty raunchy. <laughs> Chi Chi is beautiful, but I prefer Bulma the most. Is Orlando? Yeah, reasonable. <laughs> Doesn't kill you for saying that. She probably. She probably just owns it. Android Saga was cool. Yeah. I, we need to blast through Dragon Ball GT again. Me and Allison are watching it, and then we'll probably watch Dragon Ball Z again to go through that. But Allison couldn't really remember Dragon Ball GT, and I was like, yeah, it's only 64 episodes. You probably could blow through it pretty quick. But we haven't watched it this week. What makes it even funnier is that Yamcha is not even being a creep. It was just unfortunate. Yeah, it, just, it was just an accident. It was just an accident. Stuff happens. <laughs> My mustache. <laughs> Oh man, they made Vegeta look so wonky, man. So wonky. I don't know what the, what they were, you know. I guess they want to do it as like a joke, but still. I'll probably watch OG Cookie. I like. I personally like the filler of Dragon Ball. Like I, I enjoy it. There's not like not every filler episode's good, but I, I I like it. I like the filler. Just like baby so much. I, I honestly don't remember too much of them. I guess when we get there, I'll uh, I'll get I'll, I'll be able to report back on that. The only way Sonic wins if he uses Archie. The next the real question: Who wins, Archie, Sonic, or Xeno Goku? I don't know too much about the Xeno Goku 
Yeah, still, uh, oh, I forgot my tractor. <laughs> Super Dragon Ball Super. That is the biggest thing. Like I, I, I like the quirky humor and stuff, but um, freaking, <laughs> it was a little too much in Super sometimes. I got uh, Vegeta in the Broly movie was an actual joke. Broly, oh, the first Broly movie, the first one. You'll see. I remember like the world was going crazy for that Orlando. I remember Mexico was like legit trying to have watch parties. And Toei Animation was like, no, you're not. And then Mexico was like, yeah, we are. And did it anyway. <laughs> like full on theater screens with hundreds of people each. Uh, one of my favorite episodes when Goku and Piccolo. Yeah, that's, see, that's a filler episode. If you watch Kai, you don't get that episode, I don't think, Megatron. So that's why I like, like there's a lot of good filler. No one talks about Baby, baby Boo much. Baby Boo much. Archie Sonic still wins. Hey, like I said. I, I don't really care what people think, who's going to win what, like the Goku versus Superman thing. I just enjoy my Dragon Ball. <laughs> Highway to Heffel, that's right. Home for infinite losers. Leave it to the like the U.S. censorship to come up with that brilliant abbreviation cookie. Trigger happy fool who loves to look for a fight. Yeah, it's pretty much him. He's described as a hick, like a country hick. <laughs> Like basically, Goku, if dubbed correctly, be like, "Yeah, I love to fight." <laughs> uh, Barty Silver could annihilate Xeno Trunks. I'm sure Sonic can do the same with Goku. Let's just say post Frontier Sonic first, post Top Goku. Yeah, I don't know enough about Sonic. <laughs> Beerus and Beerus and Whis, to me are the best additions we've had in in Dragon Ball. I love those characters. And I, can't, I think it's a good idea to always have characters that are always going to be stronger than Goku and Vegeta. Because, you know, they're going to keep making them more and more powerful. Like, you got to have somebody that's, like, always king of the crop. That's way more powerful than Goku because I've been hearing cosmic books of sonic power. Uh... Actually heard that Archie Silver disagrees with that while the creator Xeno Trunks agrees with that match. Yeah, like I said, I don't I'll let y'all talk about that. I don't know enough about it. I don't know enough. I, I agree, Megatron, like I said, I don't know enough. <laughs> I, I don't I don't fight battles I don't know anything on. Like I gave Sonic three new forms. I'm excited for the Sonic movie coming out, the third one. And I'm hyped that Jim Carrey's back. Even though on the last one, he's like, I'm done with acting. He's back. Yeah, Beerus and Weiss, comedic duo. The voice of Weiss was at my local Comic-Con. The dude was awesome. Like, he wasn't doing Weiss's voice, but he was doing some One Piece characters laugh the entire time. And, like, you know, it's making, like, kids' days and stuff. Like... Normally, voice actors won't uh, won't do the voices because you know it gets it probably gets annoying to like do the voices all the time. But he was doing it like the entire time we were there because the writers like to go crazy sometimes. Never got to watch a superhero movie. Watch it! I need to watch it again. I bought it on 4K and I haven't watched it. They re-released it in 4K in August and I bought it because it had uh, Gohan on it. And I was like, I need. I need to watch it in 4K. And then I never did. <laughs> Oops. Dorian. Hey, Dorian. You actually met him? No, I didn't meet him. I kind of regret not doing it. I was trying to find something to buy to get him to sign, but I couldn't find anything within my price range. But I did uh, did get Chris Sabat's autograph, Vegeta's voice, and a bunch of other anime characters. Beers and Weeds are funny. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. I like them a lot. Oh yeah, the character's name is Brooke. Oh, is it Brooke? Yeah, that guy. <laughs> he kept doing the laugh. It was awesome. Cause it was like I said, all these little kids, you know, they were all dressed in their one piece stuff, and so he'd like do the laugh for them. I was like, man, he's just he's just going. <laughs> Let me a celebrity influencer myself. Go for it. Luckily here we have a pretty decently sized Comic Con. Look at Greninja Arc Z. Greninja, thank you so much for the sub. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Sub hype, guys, for Greninja. Let's go. Yeah, that laugh, Brooke. Exactly. 
Yeah, luckily we have a pretty decent, uh, like a Comic Con around here, and it's, uh, we get, we get a decent number of celebrities and voice actors and stuff. Uh, Gredenja, hey, there you are. Hello, no problem. Yeah, hello. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Is the hug Billie Eilish? I feel like, like she might be tough to get to, but you never know. You never know, man. I luckily, like, I, there was, like, a specific amount of people I wanted to meet. Well, not amount, but people I wanted to meet in my life. And I've met everybody that I've wanted to meet um, for the most parts. I've met all my, 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 um, you know, celebrity hype people. <laughs> Imagine sub equals shiny. That'd be awesome. That'd be awesome. I'd be ecstatic if that happened, Whooper. Hi, Pipe. Thanks for the hype there, guys. Appreciate you all. Appreciate you. Uh, hope you get the shiny A thing, Greninja. I hope so. I hope so. That'd be awesome. But, you know, it is a full odds hunt, no matter what. Whether you have the, whether you have the shiny charm or not, it's a full odds hunt. So, fingers crossed, it stays under odds. But, I'm here for the long haul, because I've been wanting to do this hunt for years. I've just never gotten around to it. Daddy Reynolds, my lifespan will literally double. Ryan Reynolds is awesome. It's one of those things, like, I would love to meet Ryan Reynolds, but, like, you know, I'm not, like, a super fan. I just, you know, I like his movies. Like, he's he's funny. He's hilarious. He seems like a really chill dude. Um, so I wouldn't me miss the opportunity. Or Vin Diesel. Vin Diesel family. You sure this isn't shiny locked? It's not. It's not. I've seen people hunt it. I've seen people get it. It's just, uh, you know, just a matter of fact of actually getting it. No shiny on 1420. Whack. That's whack. The W guy in general. Yeah, for sure. For sure. The celebrity you want to meet is dead. Garrett, I'm sorry. That is uh, an unfortunate thing that can happen. But I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Garrett. Who was it? Who was it? Obviously, I'm a fan of celebrities. What I care about the most, though, is how great they are to people, right? Luckily, everybody, like they say, don't meet your heroes. Luckily, everybody I've met in my life has been awesome. I've been great people. Thank goodness. I picked good people. Um, remember My Hero Academia? That anime got me so into, like, I'm so uh, dedicated with that anime. Hey, everybody has their favorite thing. That's awesome. It's awesome. Enjoy it. It's one of those things, like, for me, it was Dragon Ball. Like, I'm a huge Dragon Ball fan. I probably will be to the day I die. Like, everybody latches onto that one thing. That's, like, their comfort thing. Mine's Pokemon and Dragon Ball. <laughs> Those are my two biggest. Zelda's a close third. Like, if I have to pick just things in general. Um, like, entertainment stuff. Uh, who I want to meet is the definitely the four voices of Sonic and the designer of Wooper. <laughs> Who is... The, I'm sure you can look it up. Who's the designer of Wooper? Cookie just says my name. Well, my YouTube name. <laughs> what, Cookie? What is it? What is it? Oh, Kirk Cobain because Nirvana is one of my favorite bands of all time. And I would also like to meet Dave Grohl. Well, hey, you could meet Dave Grohl. I don't know what their meet and greet things look like. But look into that. Look into that. Um, Maybe that could be a thing. That could be a thing. That's how I met uh, my favorite singer through, through meet and greets. Um, so don't give up on that last one. But yeah, I'm sorry about, you know, Kurt Cobain. Like, that dude's quite the legend. But I was, I, even when he, when he was, he was big, I was really little. And he says, that's awesome. In his stream, and time to join. Hey, Rising. How, how, how was yours? How was your stream? Good to see you there, Rising. How are you? Checking in to see if my messages are going through. My messages are getting lost in the chat. Are they? Really? Hold on. Oh, shoot. Sorry, dude. Uh, do you think Beerus will get a girlfriend? He's got that God's Destruction Riz with Chi-Li. I think, I think in that case, Cookie, I think Brawly would be pretty pretty upset. I think Brawly, even though he's a man of little words, he's he's got some uh, some some feelings towards that green gal. Love Dave Grohl, yeah, dude's dude's a Dave Grohl's a legend. I'm so thankful and happy that the creator of Sonic actually based a lot of things on. Uh, uh, hold on, the creator of Sonic actually based a lot of things in his game on Dragon Ball. Yeah, I know like Super Sonic and stuff. 
Um, we're kind of inspired. There's a lot of in inspiration. Nope, can't find it. Who's your favorite singer? Uh, Chester Bennington of Lincoln Park. Garrett, that's my favorite. Smells like Teen Spirit. Great song. That is a good song. That is a good song. Just that intro, like guitar look. Yeah, it's iconic. That's what. That's like one of the songs. Like, even though I wasn't quite. I didn't know where I was going with music when I was younger. Like I like that's one of those, one of the most iconic songs from my childhood. Just hearing it. Um, she was just straight up afraid of Beerus. Yeah, I mean they see Beerus as a, as a god of destruction. They don't see him as like a like a pal. They're like, oh okay, yeah, we'll do whatever you want. We'll do whatever you want. <laughs> Um, so grateful. I love Toriyama, Sensei, Fly High. Yeah, I was, I was at uh, Barnes and Noble today and I went by the manga section and they had a little tribute for Akira Toriyama. It's just a note. I was like, thank you for all, all the memories and whatnot. And someone, I guess on their staff, a drone, like a drone, had drawn like a, like a little Goku face. <laughs> that was a little nice little tribute, it's a little cute tribute. I think the hedgehog pulled off the golden hair. Oh yeah, especially with the spikes. Yeah, it was it was a good one. Netflix have My Hero Academia. I'm going crazy right now. Are you gonna watch it, Orlando? Are you gonna watch it? <laughs> uh, favorite Nirvana song is either "Dumb" or the version of "The Man Who Sold the World." Ooh, that 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 the man who sold the world. That's a good one. Austin with the lurks. Austin, thank you. You gave your three viewers motion sickness. Were you walking around with your phone or something? Uh, INXS. I don't think I have Decidui. I don't think I have. Uh, it's nice of your store to do. Yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. I thought that was pretty neat. Because I, I checked, because I was going to see if they had, like, the first issue of Dragon Ball Z and the last issue of Dragon Ball Z, but they didn't. But in the spot, they had, like, a little, a little, little note. I thought it was kind of neat. Uh, Master Ultra Instinct Goku is based off hypersonic. No one can tell me otherwise. Don't worry, they weren't funny. Am I, I keep missing stuff? I didn't. I only saw that one message about Beerus and Chilai. Oh, it's pronounced in excess. In excess. Thankfully, they are more lenient with the super forms. I'm trying to hold my. Th oh, your 2DS steady into the tripod. Oh, okay. Oh, it's an 80s band. Okay. An 80s band. Dory sent me a DM. Okay. Not shiny. Um. Oh, it's a side. Is that a Psyduck, Dorian? <laughs> Is that a Psyduck? Hanging out with your couch, buddy. I'm sure Tango's probably chilling. Probably chilling. Hopefully he got a nice playtime in today. We were we were playing with him quite a bit today. An old Tango Mango. Yeah, he got quite a bit of playtime in today, which is good. Good for him. <laughs> Luckily, the weather cleared up. I was worried the weather wouldn't clear up. It was a really rainy day, and then I got home from work, and the sun came out and dried everything up, but it was pouring most of the day. It was either drizzling or pouring all day. It was gross. Plus, the artwork was official. What, about the Sonic stuff? I guess uh, y'all be able to answer that. Dorian, 82%. 82. <clears throat> nice walk on her lunch break. Did you walk today? I figured. <laughs> yeah, I usually get like a little notification when Allison walks because we're, we're Apple Watch buddies. So, I didn't see that today. It's more powerful than Goku and Vegeta. Find it absolutely bonkers. Well, right now, the, uh, the creator said Gohan currently is the strongest. Well, stronger than Goku and Vegeta. I don't know about Piccolo. 
but not Gohan like strength, but like Gohan in beast form. <clears throat> so whoa, that's crazy. 163. Yo, 163. That's right. 163. That's not shiny. 646. Hoping to get the win. Um, I just realized my like sprite thing behind me is only doing the loop once. What is going on? Why is it like that? <laughs> Why is it doing that? It should be every 30 seconds. I feel like Gohan would be one of the strongest. Yeah, if he kept training. Yeah, he has a bunch of latent power, but he doesn't like to fight. <clears throat> yeah, Prosk. He's got his, right now. He's the current strongest. I don't want to spoil anything in the manga, but Goku even says something at the end. I don't want to spoil it. But Goku says something to him. know about that yeah I need, I need to quit reading the manga because I need some surprises when they decide to ever an animate it this is being a good, he could be he could be just being a good father you know good job son even though Goku's using like 10% <laughs> rising with those lurks thank you rising thank you rising for them lurk lurks lurk a titties lurk -titties. What is wrong with my brain? Lurkatitos. <laughs> Cookie says my Pokemon Center. Oh, came in today with. Is it the Claude Sire? Did you get Clauded? Did you get Claude Sired? Attack mode, Claude Sire. Uh, yeah, Lurkatito. Sorry, I'm thinking of something else. Apparently. Uh, I mean that the creator said Beast Go is more powerful, you know. But yeah, a lot. There's a lot of a poles and in, in animes and stuff. Will it be 650? Um, it could be. It could be. No, not yet. That does look dope. Might get it soon. Yeah, I did. I saw your. I saw your post. Your your post in Discord about it. And then today they did like a, like a, funny video with it. I saw. Unless he meant most potential, possibly. Possibly, possibly. But uh, what'd you get, Cookie? Or is it secrets? Is it secrets? You received the poi pole. Ba -ba 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 -ba. A button. Not a different color. Not a different color. Wait, y'all y'all got y'all got a Discord server? That's right. We do have one. Exclamation point Discord. But if you join it, make sure you react to the rules tab. So the whole Discord opens up, because if you don't, then it looks pretty boring. They go to the rules tab, scroll to the bottom, and click the Pikachu. Click the Chew. For many tins. Oh yeah, a Palais of Fates, a Pokeball hat, and a Wooloo blanket for my brother. Hey, that's cool. A Wooloo blanket. I like that. Uh, did you open the tins yet? I was at uh, Target today and they had a bunch of the Palladium Fates tins, but now since I have the card I want, I didn't feel compelled to buy one, but I did I did look at them for a second. Also, Meyer, if you've got a Meyer near you, their uh, Pokemon cards are buy one, get one 50% off right now. So it's it's a decent deal. Even though Meyer can run a little more expensive. Being popular the whole wide world yeah when i was a kid you used to get beat up for uh, wearing anime stuff i remember i got made fun of for wearing a dragon ball z shirt now i'll walk around like i legit this shirt right here i'll wear it in public and people will be like yo nice shirt i'm like man if i wore this back in seventh grade you guys would be looking at me weird i'm gonna go sleep and i hope you get the shiny poi pole hey thank you garrett but take care get yourself some sleep and uh we'll catch you around garrett see you later Whooper, you're in. Heck yeah. Did you make sure to react to that rules tab so the whole Discord showed up for you? Oh, haven't opened it yet. Okay. All right. Looper's here. Go, Looper. What's up, Go, Looper? Good to see you. How are you? How are you? How are you? Uh, oh, Mr. Wolf's head out too. Gonna pass out. Gotta be up at 5, 4.30 for work. Catch you on the next one. Good luck. Thank you, Mr. Wolf. 
Good luck tomorrow yourself with that early shift. But you got this. Take care, Mr. Wolf. See you later. I had many a drink today. A little sippy sippy action go looper. Like like the good stuff or you had too much water. <laughs> You're, I'm just so hydrated right now, guys. I wore an Empire Strikes Back t-shirt, almost got in a fight, and not everyone pretends to be a Star Wars fan. <laughs> it's funny how that goes, man. It's funny. Yeah, I was asking Dory, is that a, is that a was that a Psyduck? Was that a Psyduck on that photo? That's pretty funny. People are pretty creative with those signs. <sighs> It looks like a Psyduck with some kind of background. <laughs> yeah, it was Chem Nation. Chem Nation promotion at the at WWE. There's such thing as water intoxication. I've heard about that. I've heard about that. I haven't ever experienced that. <laughs> I think you have to drink a lot of water. But um yeah. I have heard of that. That's wild. It's trippy. It's like, yeah, you can be a little too hydrated. Still here playing the game, bro. Are you are you playing uh, Tomb Raider? Or are you doing something different now? I know there for a little bit you were doing some Tomb Raiding. Oh yeah, till the cold medicine knocks you out. Hopefully you get some adequate amount of rest. Like even if you do still feel bad tomorrow, it's always nice to like you know at least be rested when you don't feel good. Tomb Raider. Oh yeah, the second one. Okay. I had a feeling that's what you were playing. There was a thing in Sacramento called Hold Your Wee for a Wee. Oh, yeah, I remember that. I remember that. That was, like, big news at the time. Like, when the Nintendo Wii was insanely difficult to get. Yeah, her, like, bladder, like, ruptured and, you know, caused a massive infection. <laughs> Man, it's one of those things that sounds good on paper. Like, oh, this be a good competition. And then, Yeah. <laughs> Games are long, but I like it. Yeah, from water intoxication. Oh, didn't her, I thought her bladder ruptured. Maybe I read something different. But I do remember that news headline. I do remember that. That's pretty crazy. Pretty nuts. But people were wild about the uh, the um, Nintendo Wii. I remember my dad, to get one for Christmas, he stood out in like negative degree temperatures for hours just to get one for us. Um, that was pretty nuts. He just want to make sure we had one for Christmas. Me and my brother were begging for it. Charizard the Unrivaled with the Lurk Atito. Thank you so much, Charizard. Thank you so much for the Lurk Atitos. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Shino 666. Yeah, it's coming up in two checks. Two checks. Can it happen? That'd be pretty cool. That'd be pretty cool. I've been wanting to go back to chem streams, but I just think no one's going to remember me. Do it. Do it. It's all good. I'm sure you'd appreciate you being back. You did the same for the PS5, really? I I wasn't even going to get one. I, I, I was going to get one at some point, but I got an email from PlayStation because I'm a, I was a PlayStation Network member and it's like, you've been selected to buy one, so... I just had to be in line at a specific point and I got in. And so I was like, oh, I'm already here. So I guess that means I got to buy it. <laughs> Over one mini 10, got my fifth great Tusk EX card. Ugh, the duplicates cookie. That's what drives me nuts about that set. And no shiny on 666. That sucks. I wanted that one. That'd been awesome. Yeah, Lurk Tito. That's right, Charizard. Lurk Tito. Whooper Channel 186 at Ito. Dorian 139% as well. Bummer, yeah. That's the thing I had an issue with uh, in Paldean Fates. It just seemed like the batching was terrible. And I watched other content creators open Paldean Fates, and it was just the same stuff. Like, they would just keep pulling the same stuff over. If they had, like, a bulk, like, I watched some people open, like, 500 packs of Paldean Fates, and they would keep pulling the same cards. <laughs> Every once in a while they hit something, but like it seemed to be like the same bulk amount like cards. 
PS5 is so similar to the PS4. What, power-wise? I, I think the PS5 looks gor like, gorgeous. I'm sitting there playing Hogwarts Legacy, and I'm like, holy crap. <laughs> like, this is stupid good looking. Uh, 25%. Love everyone, Austin says. Austin, thanks for hanging out tonight, man. You've been here, like, the whole night. Just, just around. I love it. I love it. Thank you. I'm loving everyone while he does it. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. Thinking of buying a plane ticket to Kentucky and breaking in your house to take your Mew card. It'll be cheaper than trying to pull it myself. Dude, go to a card shop. I'm telling you, man. Go to go find a local card shop and just see if they have, have it. Like, typically card shops are pretty cool. They don't ever force you to buy anything. Just go in there, look around. Just don't even say anything if you don't want to. <laughs> They'll usually leave you alone. Probably have a better TV than me. Maybe, I don't know, it just looks really, it just, to me it looks really good. I will say, what I like about our TV is it kind of like, has like frame predictability or something. He, uh, it like, because like, like Allison will be playing Animal Crossing and it'll run at like, a fake 60 frames per second. Like you can kind of tell, but it like, it's very fluid. And I play it on my, if I play it up on, on my monitor up here, it does not look like that good with frame rate, but for some reason down there it looks pretty good. Or when I play like Pokemon, it looked pretty good on there. It looked pretty fluid. Yeah, getting past the guard dog. Yeah, for real. For real, guard dog. Guard dogs are uh, are us. <laughs> Me and Tanya go way back. <laughs> we go way back. The way back machine. <laughs> yeah, not shiny. Not shiny. We received a poi pull, not a shiny poi pull, getting close to seven hundred. Four, five, six, seven. We've done almost 400 encounters. That must have been slow last night. Getting everything. I guess it took me a little bit to get in a rhythm because we are crushing the encounters. We're not getting the shiny, but we're crushing encounters tonight. Bork, bork. Yeah, pretty much. It'll be more than that. It'll be bork madness. We're getting March madness. We're bork madness. Tonight on Bork Madness. Bork, bork, bork. 1420, yeah, you're, you haven't went any further? You haven't went any further on encounters? Did you, did you take, did you stop for a little bit? Oh, taking a break, all right. Don't blame ya. I don't blame ya. I think you're gonna go on a Borkathon, <laughs> pretty much. Pretty much, it's a good way to put it. Yotman, petition to call Pokemon fans Game Freaks. <laughs> a lot of people, a lot of Pokemon fans don't wanna be associated with Game Freak though, I feel like, especially after the, it seems like everybody like, kinda of turned their back on him finally after the, the Scarlet and Violet stuff. Although, they'll announce a new game and everybody will eat it up, at least at the, at the start. <laughs> How's it going, Yotman? How are you? I mean, I personally like it, Game Freaks. I'm curious how they're, I know Game Freaks making like a new game. I'm curious how that game is gonna, gonna perform. I'm like genuinely curious. BSP was uh, not made by Game Freak was so much better. I know, yeah, well, ILCA, what, up until that point, they have only made, they only made like mobile games. I just think I just think the uh, it comes down like also the the development time kind of sucks. Like you you get rushed work. It's not ever gonna be perfect. Uh, yo, Bethany, Game Freak will release the old games on Nintendo Online. Everyone will love them again. <laughs> yeah, honestly, I feel like that's like the best bet. I would love for them like don't, they don't even have to touch the games. Just you know maybe make them like run well. Like you know like maybe uh, like an HD like 
because I don't know if you've ever seen people run like emulators like Sun to Moon stuff. It looks really clean. Like put that on the Switch and you know, call it a day. Make sure it has home compatibility. That'd be beautiful. <laughs> put all the old games on. They don't need to be HD remakes or anything. Just give them home compatibility. People would be like, hallelujah. Especially the people that can't go out like me and go buy a copy of Black 2 because it's like $210. I heard they're going to be adding DEI, so we'll see how that goes. On, um, on what in, in Pokemon? In the Pokemon Pikachu's, take advantage of nostalgia. I agree. I agree. Remakes are always nice. It's always cool to see your favorite games or games you grew up with with like 3D visuals and stuff. But I think a lot of people would be pretty stoked just to get the old games like you know how they put them on the 3ds like put them on the switch virtual console let me own the game <laughs> i don't want to have nintendo online service where i can use it no let me buy the game for like 10 15 bucks or something and own it the digital version is this hunt full odds yodman yes it is whether you have the shiny charm or not this is still uh still a full odds hunt unfortunately but hey we're gonna rock it I'm not going to give up. I've been wanting to do this hunt for a long, 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 long time. Dorian says yes. Pokemon games. Yeah. Hiring a DEI person for 200 K a year. I'm in. I don't even know what I'd be doing, but I'm in. <laughs> candy. Austin find that $200,000 candy. 200 K a year. That's beautiful. I wonder if that's like yen or something. Ooh, I'd be buying a lot of candy. I wouldn't even need to find candy. I'd just be buying candy. <laughs> uh, imagine getting the shiny first try and not knowing it was shiny because the first one, you, yeah, like some kids playing Pokemon Sun and Moon for the first time, they receive Poipo and they're like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> I like that color scheme. <laughs> no candy for Dorian. Uh oh, it might be on like a cooldown. Might be on somewhat of a cooldown or something. Uh, no, they won't add any DEI in Japan. They just wouldn't accept it there. Okay. All right. Yeah, I was just kind of spitballing. Just America and UK. All right. Noise. I don't know. I would just, I'm down with whatever it takes to get like a super good quality Pokemon game. Like I still like Scarlet and Violet. I thought they were great, but I see why people, you know, were like, Wow biggest one of the biggest franchises in the world and you know this is what you get got some candy there you go <laughs> just took a little longer got me candy om nom 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 everybody just doing candy keep stealing it all Womp womp. Not shiny. Anyway, got a lurk. Big day tomorrow. In the process of getting my driver's license. Three years too late. Hey, it's never too late to get that freedom there, Yodman. Heck yeah. Good luck. I hope you're able to get it. Hope you're able to get it tomorrow. Definitely let us know, but good luck to you. You got this. You got this. Yeah, the candy's all mine. Still, get, Oh, me, Megatron. I, I've told this story. Like, I mean, some of you guys were here. Like, when they dropped uh, Scarlet and Violet's DLC Part 2 and we didn't get a chance to shine at the Legends, I legit almost ended the stream. I just was, like, so bummed about that. <laughs> ended up having a good time with it, had fun with the story, but I was really bummed about the Legends. Just some of the ones we haven't been able to hunt. Like Cub Chew and Glaceteer and all the other ones. Gonna have to make another candy run. The candy jar is getting low. It's getting low, 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 low. See you tearing up. It definitely wasn't tearing up. It's more like lame. Like this is lame. <laughs> YouTube is not receiving enough data to remain to maintain smooth streaming. Sorry if there's any lag, guys. 
I didn't even get to see anything until YouTube told me otherwise. Oops. Sorry, y'all. There's Dorian doing a candy run. Dorian's got us. Dorian's got us down on lock. Is it Halloween already? No, not yet. Easter, though. There's a lot of Easter candy out there. Lots of Easter candy. Yeah, Easter. Easter candy. That's not shiny. You're not that way that you should be. With that nine seconds of your life back. <laughs> what, the, the DLC or did I do something? <laughs> Where's my candy? Well, the command getting used so many times, the, uh, the night bot might not be able to keep up. It might not be able to keep up. <laughs> yeah, Austin has it. <laughs> no, says Bryce. No, yeah, it's all mine. It's all mine. Get some Easter candy. I'm gonna go on. Uh, I'm gonna go on the Monday after Easter and see if I can scrounge up some some good deals. Some Easter grass, aka sour, sour, Haribo sour worm things. But they call it Easter grass, even though it's the same thing. Oh, you just waste the nine seconds anyway. You forgetting about Easter? I think a lot of people did. Like, it, it just kind of snuck up. Kind of just snuck up as like, Easter is here. What? <laughs> the Twizzlers, hey, busy. Twizzlers are great. Twizzlers are great. Are you visiting your niece for your Easter? I am not. I don't have the time thanks to work, but I would love to go visit sometime soon. Love to visit sometime soon. I get another week off next month at some point. So, um, hooray, hooray for that. <laughs> Maybe at that point. It has been since December, and I, I miss them quite a bit. I get Friday off. Love living in the Bible Belt. <laughs> that does help. That does help. Funny, I work with a lot of religious people, but we still we still work. <laughs> we still work and all that good stuff. Um, but good to see you there, busy. Hope all is well on this Tuesday. Today's tu yeah, today's Tuesday. On this Tuesday for you, busy. Bryce got the candy. There you go. There you go. At some point, the commands would uh, die off and you'd get yours. Way to go. Way to go. Yeah, it's Tuesday. The day of, there's two. It's twice the day. <laughs> some people at work probably felt like it was uh, the equivalent of two days out there. Felt the same equivalence. Not shiny. Figured a little, ooh, would, would bring it out, but it didn't. Sounds like someone's actual real name. Wait, what was it? What was it? Purple. This is check number 700. Another increment of 100 here. Another increment. Not shiny. Womp. New batch of the century mark. New century mark batch. Oh, my eggs are so sore. 
Daisy said hi to Austin E. Dorian. Oh, okay. Austin E. Dorian. <laughs> name, the name's Dorian. Austin E. Dorian. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, you got a migraine? One of my coworkers had a migraine today. Maybe it's like National Migraine Day. That sucks. And you're sitting here watching watching the stream busy? You got one of the most annoying people talking right now. And you're here with a migraine. It's impressive. Gonna relax tomorrow. Yeah, gonna relax. Gonna chill. You know, have a day off. Have a day off and ch 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 chill. Like a chinchilla. Chinchilla. <laughs> but uh yeah i think i'll probably take a little break do you do you act, do, are you working tomorrow cookie always i, I know i joke but like legit i'm like for real <laughs> like all the jokes have gotten me confused oh you're sl slow right now yeah, hopefully that doesn't last too long at all. Bump that. I'm going to bring that back. Good classic sax quote. Bump that. Yo, you don't work tomorrow? Heck yeah, dude. Day off. Day off. A very squishy. Very squishy. Oh, squinty. I read it as squishy. I was like, squishy? <laughs> Work tomorrow, then I'm off till Monday. Dang, that's a good one, Dorian. That's a good one. That's a good, good day, a couple days off. Uh, I gotta head out, have a great night. Wish you all the best to catch you all next time. Sounds good, Austin. Thank you so much for being here. Appreciate you. But uh, have a good rest of your night, man. Thank you for being here, and we'll catch you next time. See ya. <laughs> Squishy too. <laughs> Oh, man. I just looked at it really quick and thought I saw Squishy. <laughs> Don't. I'm Squishy, too. I'm feeling like Jello after that, that leg day or whatever the heck we just did. Probably still see you tomorrow. Oh, snap. To see me tomorrow? You have to be quick. I'm on the move. I'm on the move a lot. So squishy. He's so squishy. Stop calling me out, man. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. thumbs up and subscribe if you want so nice of you Brandon to be so polite back in the day when he made that night bot command that's right squishy squisher squishy squisher would you like to take it yep shiny luck squishy well night bot like that 28% eh not not as not as liked as some other words. It's so fluffy. Speaking of that, there is a new Despicable Me coming out. I keep forgetting that's a thing until we saw Ghostbusters and they showed the trailer for it. I was like, oh yeah, there's a fourth one coming out. 28% boo. You do you boo. Fluff 23%. The, the luck is out. The luck has died. Oh, Cookie said Greninja, Chimchar, and Snubble are getting Funko Pops soon. Oh, boy. <laughs> I, I had to give up on Funkos for the most part because they are... Oh, my gosh. There's just so many. Like, I'd probably give in maybe if they started making shiny versions. I know you can get a custom shiny one, but... I think I'm going... Hold off. 
Yeah, Despicable Me. All the Facebook mean, all the Facebook minion memes will be, will be back. Exercise. I thought you said extra fries. With the minion going. You only have one Funko Pop. Well, you're blessed. I have like seventy. <laughs> I got really into Dragon Ball Funko Pops. Although I do have some that are like apparently worth a lot of money. I don't know if I'd actually get that, but they're worth that much. Oh, it's stupid sexy Flanders. Nice. <laughs> nice. You can FaceTime on your lunch break. I don't get a lunch break. I just eat while I work. I eat while I work and I'll go on a walk sometimes. That's about it. Like today I was sitting there eating lunch and my business partner came in and was like, here's all these ideas. <laughs> like I was legit like in the middle, like then to put it down and take notes for, for a little while. Get your mystery gift on. Get your mystery gift. Nope. Pay two dollars for it. It looks like it's gone up. I'm sure. Yeah, once they, uh, once they um, go into the vault, you know, they don't make them anymore. So there's, there's always a chance they might go up in price. I want to start my journey in BDSP already, but I want to play my Pokemon Sword or Shield or Scarlet or Violets. A lot of, a lot of games to catch up on if you've played them. Kind of have to pick and choose wisely there, Orlando. So like Squishy, 132, 132. I mean, he's only gotten one Dorian. <laughs> kind of wherever he probably got that one at. Wherever he got that one at, I guess. He received the Poi Pole. Did I? It's never official until it shows up on my screen. No, it's not shiny. A lot better than mine, says Dorian. <laughs> A lot better. A lot better. Extra squishy. Oh, stop it. Oh, stop it. 111, make a wish. It's 111, make a wish. Bought this one in uh, all the Comic Con. Nice. Comic Con. Those are always a good spot. If you can find a local Comic Con that uh, has a decent size to it, you can find so many Funko Pops. There was one booth at mine like that were really overpriced <laughs> like absurdly overpriced it was kind of crazy i was like do they want to sell i don't think they want to sell these i think they're basically just flexing them from hot topic since i have a five dollar off coupon okay there you go five dollar off coupon it's a good worthy reason to, to have it remember the squishy uh, squishy bonnie zygarde doesn't bother you. Yeah, I'm pretty squishy myself, but I'm also a sore squishy today. I, uh, the guy had a million, but saw this uh, one and I laughed until I gave the man money. <laughs> Sometimes, you know, you just see something you gotta get. And luckily, you only stopped at one because I was like, ooh, I ordered Battle of Gods. A Dragon Ball movie from Funimation's site and they gave me a Funko Pop. It was the Super Saiyan God Goku. And, you know, I was cool with that. And then I started seeing more and more that I wanted and got it got out of control. And now I have too many. <laughs> hey, what's up, Jerry? How's it going, Jerry? Hope you're having a good good day. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. Who has a favorite Pokemon game of all time? Yours a sword and shield? Oh, I don't know what's my favorite of all time. It changes all the time. I just like all the Pokemon games. I can find usually something good with all of them. 
Uh, my favorite generation though is like Gen 2. I love Gen 2. Gen 2 is such a fun time. Such a good time. Kids going crazy at recess. There's new Pokemon! Oh my god! <laughs> it's good times. Good, good times. Pokemon Go counts. You know, surprising. I mean, surprising a lot of casual players, Pokemon Go is their favorite, favorite way to play Pokemon. I say it feels like you're wearing. Yeah, it feels like you're wearing uh, nothing at all all the time. So I had to have this one. <laughs> it feels like you're wearing nothing at all. <laughs> hey, back to you there, busy. Back to you. Ooh, the bass kick. Probably can't hear that on mic. My chest has a built-in subwoofer. Doom doom. Allison still likes Violet's. Violet was her first game. She's currently playing through Shield right now, though. Sorry, Sword, Sword, Sword. Sorry. Sword. I must fall on the sword for my honor. Shoulder scoop and a squeeze moment. I received a poiple. That poiple wasn't shiny. So we pressed the A again. Boom. Da boom. Da boom boom. Da boom. Yeah. I was looking at my arm too long. Now it's dead. I should have turned the switch arms. Oh no. <laughs> All the blood is gone. Now you got to hold yourself like at an angle. Got to get the blood flow back. What time is it there right now? It is 1149 PM for me. Getting kind of close to the end here, but it is late. It's a late one. It's getting late for for old me when I gotta go to work in the morning. But at least it's been a good time. <laughs> now we just need this poi pole to make it even a better time. Poi pole. Poi pole the snowman. We're gonna make a poi pole snowman. I'll just build it and then dogs will come pee on it and they'll make it shiny. Shiny colors. Still a long time away from the 224, which is your prediction. But we will get there. We'll get there, you know. 2%. 2% from Dorian. Hey, I guess it's better than zero. It's better than zero. <laughs> Take this Clefairy anytime now. Are you just like watching them pop up? Just waiting for that gr those green ears? Are you, are you just, are you, are you going to keep chaining them? Like, I know people are like, oh, I'm gonna chain them and whatnot, but I'm like, man, I'd rather just sit around and wait, just chill and see if one shows up. Hug Dorian. Hug. Hug. Hug a lug. Da 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 Oh, you've been doing both off and on. Okay. Hey, best of both worlds. I forgot who's saying that. Is it Miley? The best of both worlds. Or Hannah Montana. I don't know. Same person, but you know. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha, Dorian. I had a feeling I was close. I had a feeling I was close with it. I've burned 1,167 calories, but I've probably ate 300,000 calories today. Oh, you have like 120 to send to the professor. At least it's not too hard to do. I mean, granted, you got to take a break at points, but you can at least send things back pretty quickly in, in, the, let, in the Let's Go games. I haven't touched the Switch in a while. That poor Switch just over there collecting dust. I remember my Wii U, like, legit collecting dust. Like, it was at some point. I remember when, when the Skyward, sorry, not Skyward, uh, Twilight Princess HD and Wind Waker HD came out. Like, I had to legit dust off the Wii U. Like it was just covered in dust. <laughs> I 
My Switch, on the other hand, gets a lot of action. I, I like the Switch. It's probably my favorite console of all time. <clears throat> yeah, preoccupied, yeah. You know, life gets in the way. Allison's right. Life gets in the way, but not in a bad way. When I say get in the way, it sounds like bad. Keep it charged or kill your battery. Speaking from experience, did you let yours die that never came back? RIP switch battery. You're the one that never lasted. Good to know. Good to know. Look at that poipo wiggle. Kick that left leg out. Kick. 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 Yeah, I'll take the poipo with me. Why not? Why not? Not shiny. Womp. It has to be on the charger pretty much constantly. Lives about 20 minutes. Dang. My, my generation one switch. It still works pretty good. It's battery life's not OG great, but um, I feel like you can play, like I know Allison sometimes takes it off the dock and plays it. Um, and, it and it does pretty it does pretty well. Plays for a couple hours. It's now the extra in the house. Yeah, Allison has my OG one. I have the, I have the OLED. The OLED, OLED, OLED. Yeah, battery's amazing. Yeah, I, I was on a whole. I, like mine lasted the entire flight from. It, I forgot how long the flight was, but from, from, Kentucky all the way to Vegas. Yeah, it lasted the entire time. Yeah, you. So oh yeah, you sold the OLED. That's right. Oh, I like I like the OLED. It's nice. Isaiah, what's up, Isaiah? How are you, Isaiah? How are you? Would you like to take the poi pole? Yes, I would. Give me that poi pole. Nope. Probably a five hour flight. It, that, that sounds about right. That sounds about right. But yeah, it lasted the entire time, which I really thought it was gonna die. But it was kind of getting in the red when I when I landed. Uh, how's you been? I'm, Isaiah, I can't complain. I can't complain. Been, been, uh, been having a good time. How about you, Isaiah? My work is crazy, but I'm off. Nice. Hopefully now you can decompress a little bit, Isaiah. Uh, how's the stream? It's good. I've had a good time. Just hanging out. Just hanging out and all that good stuff. Some good conversation. How much longer are we going for? I have like 12 minutes. <laughs> 12 minutes and I gotta, gotta skedaddle. Only because I gotta work. If I didn't, maybe I'd go longer, but you know, I gotta get some sleep. Five hours is pretty good. Yeah, I just kept the I just kept the like the light kind of down just in case. Um, and yeah, it lasted a pretty long time. Gotta say, it was it was good. I did. I got crazy on those Black Friday deals. <laughs> it happens. It happens to the best of us. Busy it happens to the best. Isaiah, yeah, you you are. But hey, you get to see the you get to see the end with us. And you know, appreciate you showing up. That's awesome. Um, let's see. Just call out, yeah. <laughs> John, what's going on, John? What up? Why 12 minutes? Because it'll be a full. I, I try to get a full three hour stream in. I get. I try to get the full three hours. That's so. I when I looked at the clock, it was about 12 minutes for a full three hour for a full three hour stream. You've been behaving though. Heck yeah, <laughs> it's tough. It's tough. I'm always seeing things I want constantly. And it's hard to like talk yourself out of it. We're using rubber bands for this hunt, this hunt twice and they're a lifesaver. Oh yeah, you know what, John? I got those rubber, rubber bands on. <laughs> all I'm hitting is the A button and then the start button. <laughs> that's all I'm doing the entire time. Uh, but yeah, that's the only reason. That's the only reason, Megatron. Oh, but I didn't mean to hit the A button on that. Reset. <laughs> What color is your 3DS? The one I'm playing on is just white. It's just a white one or whatever they called it, pearl or something. 
like when I when I ordered it the capture card like they he just had like a stock of them and I you know I'm paying for the 3ds plus installation so there's no guarantee on which one I got and mine's white and it works <laughs> it works although it's pretty beat up same with cards right right how much is the capture card the 3ds capture card combo is about 400 dollars. it's like the og 3ds like og 3ds and a capture card installed they had some xls but they were a little i think it was like 600 700 and that was too much for me this this was scary enough to buy <laughs> things are expensive yes they are very expensive is there buying a 3ds one of my, my well my local one of my local places they have a ton of 3ds's over at the mall like, there's a bunch to choose from some are really rare they have like a really crazy limited edition disney one and they went like 600 and 700 dollars for it <laughs> it's pretty pricey i'd rather just buy a capture card one i honestly didn't care if the thing was pink i would i would have taken it as long as they can do the streamy thing Really excited for your work trip. Hey, nice. Where you head to, Isaiah? If, unless you know, you don't have to disclose that. But I uh, hope it's hope it's fun. I, it's funny. I I don't really get excited for work trips because I don't like being gone. It's just not. I kind of I just don't do it anymore. Uh, but I do a lot of trips on occasion. Oh, 3ds XL. You want to play Alola? You can find some decent deals on them. I'd say you get one soonish before you know. People start trying to get that nostalgia price on them. What made you get the Litten card used to Pikachu? No, it had a shiny on it. <laughs> it has well, it's not a shiny Litten, but it's a, a drawing of a shiny Litten um, on the card, and so it's like right, it's like right there on there the shiny Litten. It's coming into focus, sort of, but it's there on the card. And you know, I like shiny Pokemon, so I was like, I'm gonna invest in this five dollar card. Uh, type null. I want to, John. I want to. I've considered it. If we get this, then I, I think I gotta like get to the post game or something to uh, to get to that. So thinking about it. Thinking about it. Dallas and approve of that purchase. Probably not, but I got it anyway. Can't wait to say hi to the Cobra chickens. Oh yeah, you can do that here in the U.S. They're everywhere where I live. They're everywhere. Plus, got peeps in Canada, so it's gonna be a mix of work and pleasure. All right, dude, nice, nice. Yeah, hopefully, yeah, you get some time to time to do whatever you need to. He does whatever he wants. Hey, you do too, kinda. Get a package at the door. I don't know what it is. I'm just like, yep, yeah, this is for Allison. And I just lay it on the couch. <laughs> Be there for some time. Fairly excited. Dang. So they got you there for a little while. They got you there for a bit. That as yeah, as long as you have fun, that's awesome. Do whatever I want to. Yeah, it's a bad habit. <laughs> I try to stay in check. I try to stay in check. I think we do pretty good, both me and Allison collectively. I also, you know, he realized like, you know, there's a certain uh Certain amount of money you have in the bank. You can't go too crazy. Yep, says Isaiah. Heck yeah, dude. Live it up. Live it up. Live it up. Live it up. And still going. Still going. Got a little bit longer here. And we'll call the night here in just a bit. I out of focus. Look at my hand camera. I'm the captain now. May I gift you this poiple? Yes, for the 754th time you can. All right. LOL, says Allison. LOL. LOL surprise dolls. Give me that purple. Give me that purple, yeah. 
Lots of luck. That's right. That's what she. That's what she meant, Dorian. Lots of luck. What in the world? What? I don't know. <laughs> I'm just rambling. I don't. I don't really like dead air, so I just. I just start rambling. So if you hear some random BS, that's just. That's just me. It's like the. It's like the audio equivalent of twiddling my thumbs. Both of my poiple hunts went over odds. I, I, a lot of people have told me that, John. A lot of people have said that to me. They're like, good luck. Both of my hunts sucked. <laughs> um, although I watched a video where HDV got his an eight check. So, you know, we're every once in a while. Captain. Captain Pikachu. Two LOL a lot. I have a bad habit of like saying LOL on like every text message. I don't know what that means. Because I'm obviously not laughing all the time. Sometimes, for real, yeah. That's why I love the streams where I just randomly say words. Meow too, says Dorian. Meow too. Plus, I got a friend in Canada that is getting uh, is getting fairly ill, so I get to see her. Okay, Isaiah. Well, that's good. That's good. Can't spell Allison without LOL. Dang, Sax, that's good. That's good. <laughs> Dang, dude. <laughs> John says, LOL, LOL. <laughs> Be the person to say, sorry you're having a bad day, LOL. Yeah, it depends on the context. It depends on the context. <laughs> but uh, yeah, probably. <laughs> probably. Woof. Woof. I think I'm like semi blurry ever since I showed that card like focus on the hand and come back okay that looks better definitely more crisp uh I'll add LL so people know I'm not I'm kidding or sarcastic I think that's why I do it Megatron just like you know I'm that means like it means like I'm in a in a light-hearted reply mood that's what it means like ha <laughs> Like, this is so cool, LOL. Like, it's like, it's a good day. <laughs> it's a good day. That is true. Yeah, that's like the best quote of the night, I feel like. <laughs> Having LOL at the straightest face on earth. I'm guilty of that. I think it's the story of like everybody's lives. Just what we do. <laughs> It's so easy to do, Isaiah. So easy. <laughs> Glad to know, like, you know, we're all not alone. We're in, we're an LOL anonymous, even though you can see our names in chat. LMAO is the new LOL, really? I've used, I use that on occasion, especially if it's actually really funny. Oh, the stream froze while I did that? Perfect. Perfect. Well, I'm glad YouTube chose that point to freeze. <laughs> I've just sent a lot of comical, oh, comical, critical emails. Like, you need to add this command or don't say that. So an LOL will lighten the mood. Yeah, just, you know, a little sprinkle a little LOL in there. <laughs> That's all you need. LMFAO is next level. Yeah, or a bunch of laughing emojis. Cat, you're back. Welcome back, Cat. Welcome back. Laughing my flippin' arse off. <laughs> there's levels too, yeah. There's certain tiers when it comes to to the to the lightheartedness. I do LOLZ sometimes, Dorian, as well. I like a good LOLZ every once in a while if there's something silly going on. A little, little lols, lols action. All right, I think I'm gonna go to 770. We'll go to 770 for the night. I should put us at a good four, sorry, three hour stream. Can't do four hours. I'd be cranky tomorrow. Actually, I laugh. I mean, I laugh a lot too, but it's always usually for real. <laughs> Sometimes there's that nervous laugh, like, ha, 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 I don't know what you just said, but I'm gonna laugh and hope you walk away. <laughs> I don't feel right typing it. <laughs> LOLZ. All are welcome for this chat tonight. <laughs> LOL laughing a lot. Wow. 
Wow. See you on Thursday, Brandon. Good night. Good night, Decidueye. Have a good night. Take care. But yeah, I'll see you Thursday, dude. See you Thursday. Peace out. Hey, town down. Make it four hours. No, I can't. <laughs> I can't. Legit. I would not be in a good mood tomorrow. I can't have a, I can't have a grumpy hump day. It's not good. It's not good. <laughs> Call it grump day instead of hump day. Oh, Brandon's on his grump day. So that whenever I say LOL, I have to switch it up. Yeah, yeah. The cookie, same way, man. Same way. <laughs> I feel that. I feel that. You wouldn't make it, cat. You wouldn't make it. I just saw your profile picture just change. That's great. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Actually hurt. Not hurt, but I like almost choked. Almost choked doing a little piggy snort. <laughs> Do a 24 hour stream. I don't think I like even if I slept and prepped and everything, I don't think I could do 24 hours. I wouldn't mind one day to stream and just see how long I could go for, but I don't think I could go for 24 hours. I feel like my like my throat would hurt too much. I've done an 11 hour stream before and it just like I was not really feeling well by the end of it. All right, one more check here, guys. I guess while I'm doing this check, thank you guys for the 47 likes. Appreciate you guys. Uh, we got Brainchild doing a two-month flex tonight. Thank you, Brainchild, for that two-month flex. Coming in and dipping out. Yeah, all the jokes. Throat goat, nah. That's just when it comes to, like, singing and screaming, I guess. Uh, 24 hours for rookie numbers. Do 48. <laughs> yeah, do 48. <laughs> exactly. Like, Friday, a guy owed me a report, like, and he had the software, and I did it. Uh, it would take him like five minutes for him, but I had to keep bugging him. So there's a lot of the lolling. Yeah, to keep it keep it nice. Hey, John Flex in four months. Thank you for the four there, John. Thank you, thank you. Last check, best check. Isn't the best check. I thought we would get it. But there we go. That was check 770. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. We got a lot of checks tonight. We blew through some checks. So hopefully that shiny is coming soon. Hopefully you hit that shiny frame and life will be good or seed, whatever we, we're doing here. Um, but yes, yeah, Axe, take care of yourself. Take care. Um, but good night, Dorian. Throat goats wild, right? <laughs> Passive aggressive holes. <laughs> e with that hype. Thank you, E and Decidueye, Cookie, all that good stuff. Thank you all. Let's see who's here. We got Allison, Busy, Cookie, Decidueye, Dorian, E, Isaiah, J uh, John, Cat, Megatron, Prosk, and Sax. Thank you guys for hanging out. And if there's any lurkers, thank you as well. I know Christian said they were lurking, so. Appreciate you guys. Thanks for being here. And uh, yeah, hopefully we'll get this next stream. But I'll see you all Thursday. And uh, yeah, we'll rock it then. But until then, have a great Wednesday. And uh, I'll see you all soon. Bye, guys.